Hey, hello. Welcome, 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 welcome. How's it all going? Can you all hear me fine? I hope you can. Because if not, I'm going to have to change some things, so let me know if you can't hear me properly. Hope you're all doing well. On a Saturday Eve. I literally just remembered I had to tweet and notify Discord as well that I was streaming. So I was a couple seconds late. You can hear me fine? Alright. Let me know if you ever cannot hear me. Or the game properly, and I'll change it. Happy birthday, Devi. Hope you're having a good one. I've... Never... Never, never, never played Vision Quest or participated in any discussions about it. I don't remember anything about this game. I have no idea what is coming for me. Some people said some names in chat, I forgot all of them already. Uh, but please, no spoilers. Anyway. Uh, I'm gonna read the story, I'm gonna go through the story. I don't know if I'll voice act it all or read it all out. I'll probably get tired of reading it all out at some point. And it might go a little bit faster, but... At first, I definitely want to read the story, because that's like the main thing about Raw Max, right? Is they put a lot of effort in, so you want to get, do that justice. I've only heard good things about this hack. Uh, difficulty, good question, good question. Uh, also, all credit to Pandan for making this, of course, as said in the description. I think he was in chat earlier, I know he is right now. Uh, but yeah, we're playing on normal, because when the designer says, this is the intended difficulty, this is what you should do in your first run, you should do this, uh, hard. You know, more like lunatic. How about no? I have I have considered easy actually, because sometimes it can be a little bit tiresome to play on their intended difficulty, because it tends to be harder than normal FE. But we'll see. And yeah, I know I got you. You guys are you got my back for um, you know guidance, as it were. Because I'm gonna be I'm doing this solo. I probably maybe will involve like some kind of co-host at some point if I feel like I need one. Uh, but as long as I don't, you know, I'm happy to do it solo. Uh, I'm sure it'll be tricky at some points, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Because if it's like if it's like every 12 difficulty right, which I mean they call the player phase based, so it might might be, then oh it's gonna get uh, interesting. But definitely not gonna play on hard. Definitely not gonna play on hard. Let's just play on normal for now. And if it turns out it's way too hard, we can always switch to easy. Like contrary to popular belief, I am not against easy modes. I should Iron Man. No, I don't like blind Iron Mans. I'd rather have a team I stick with. I'd rather have the option to reset and turn wheel. Let's see what we got here. Lord of Vespasian, my dear brother and esteemed guests. I trust tonight's meal and musical accompaniment has been to your liking. Lord Gratin, of course. I thought I ever said Gratin for a moment. Of course. Uh, Gersoup, that's not my taste, that's Rin's taste, but yeah. <laughs> the wine and cheese was simply delectable. The dry nature of this red wine, paired with this sharp cheddar, it is simply a heavenly delight. Coupled with the Woodwinds Ensemble lovely performance, I struggle to find words apt to describe this magnificent combination. Thesaurus moments. To speak succinctly, it is quite to my liking indeed. Get used to food speeches? Alright, I will. Why didn't she just count one? Alright, got it. You flatter me, my dear brother. But there is still business for us to discuss here tonight. Please take a look at this map. I've taken the liberty of marking it with the towns you are responsible for. In the next month you will go and collect taxes from the populace. And apprehend any unable to afford the payments. Ah, yes, my favorite thing to do. Collect taxes. Dare to be brought to the fort near my manse. I still have to do my tax things, which is like, ugh. Thanks, game, for reminding me. Six towns in southern Malaro. Dear brother, I understand the importance of this task, but one month is simply too short of a time to complete this. With preparations sorting the men, this is three months at least. <laughs> he literally wrote a wrist list of parentheses in the game. <laughs> You question my plan? You will do this in one month, as asked, Lord Vaspasian, excuse me. Lord Gratin, my dear brother, one month is simply too short a time. You never mind you, brother, it is I who rules Bellaro. I am the lord of the state, answering to the emperor himself. Bellaro's future is mine to command, and my will is not to be questioned. You will complete the task, as asked, within one month's time. Brother. Your tone is most unlike you. I've noticed this during our time together. Your hair is unkempt, your worlds drill off as though your mind is elsewhere. Yeah, I know, I'm trying to think if my stream is stable or not. Tell me, what is the urgency? I sat by months ago when you first began these practices, but now you do not seem to welcome any debate on your policy. Imposing newer, harsher, and more frequent taxes on the citizens. Are you being controlled by a dark god? 
townspeople are suffering. The economy is faltering. Surely you see that we must change course here. Hmm, so now you choose to share your true feelings, dear brother. Bolaro has been the laughing stock of our Emperor for too long. These backwater boondocks, or so they've been labeled, will rise to be the greatest state in the land. Another big problem with voice acting for me is I have to drink a lot of water. So I hope you don't mind me hydrating. Your descent is unwarranted and makes me truly question your loyalty to me and my rule brother. Descent? To disagree with her policy is now an act of rebellion? Lord Brandon, this behavior is most unwarranted. We used to work together to push our state forward. Now you cannot justify your actions when brought to question. Lord Vespasian, you will not raise your voice at me. Brother or not, it is I who rules here. Do not dare question me again, brother. Dare of questioning you? This is not the language of a reasonable ruler. It belongs only in the lexicon of foul tyrants. Lord Gradon, tell me, what is the purpose of this? Answer me. Lord Vaspasian, you are testing my patience. I'm not gonna play the FB8 final map theme. I suppose there is no more suitable time in the present moment to share what I've learned. When I first heard the rumors, I turned the other way. My brother, you can do this. Do I voice act professionally? No. <laughs> Nowhere near good enough. The gossip of courtesans and old maids were but a farce. But you have the temerity to label me as a tyrant? I suppose it is as I have feared, and these rumors are true. Tell me of these rumors, Lord Gradon. You're a traitor. I would like to hear what you've heard. That you have assembled allies and plan to take the throne. However, Lord Vespasian, while your reputation as a cunning strategist is not unearned, you fail to account for the loyalty of those to me. Me, the ruler of Bolaro. Lord Gradon, I have no intent of usurping the throne, like the plot of some droll play. As a noble statesman of Bolaro, I only wish to bring prosperity. Not just to us and our kin, but to all citizens of the state. These rumors are but falsehoods, conjurations of restless housewives, and those who seek to see Bolaro's noble ta family in tatters, frayed, weather-beaten, and, and weak. Inexorable as always. Even when presented with the truth, you choose to spew lies. Horrible, horrible lies. Unfortunately, my dear brother, this treasonous act will not be met with kindness. Yeah, don't spoil on chat, please. This is absurd. You would kill me here in your home? Brother, you have lost your mind to madness. To see how much you've changed. What transpired? Tell me. Silence! I will not take counsel nor pity from you. My younger brother, he who seeks to steal the throne from me. We duel. No. Not Vespasian. You got gratted. I don't know what is this point and what isn't. Vespasian, you noble fool. You always stuck your nose in the affairs of others. This time it cost you dearly. There were no rumors. There was no talk. You do not understand the scope of this threat. Should we not meet his demands, Bolara will be in ruin. This is the only way to ensure our future. Now we can't collect taxes for you. Do you think of that? Oh well. As spring's temperatures helped the citizens of Bolaro forget about the long winter that passed, the smiles of the people began to return. What usually is a joyous time, celebrated with fine fish and breads. Are we keeping count of food? Are we gonna do a food counter? You guys wanna do a food counter? I'm gonna do a food counter. I have to, I have to bottom right clean anyway. Let me see. I'm gonna do a food counter. We need it. I just decided. it. Food counter. Food counter, uh, read from f how it is. I guess I'll just do it manually. One, two food counters. You get a good font. Do I have this this one cool font here? I do. Nice. Okay. Is that the one? And we need some uh, we need some outline. Hold up. Nice. Okay. Make it a little bit bigger. 10, 20, 30, 30, oh, 25, it's 20 to max, 20 to max, okay, whatever, 20 it is, there you go, okay, food counter, oh, actually we need to make it smaller, food counter, two, let's make it a bit smaller, we gotta have a food counter in this game, I, I can tell, we need a food counter, food counter, maybe like this, food counter, perfect, let's make it, Center. There you go. Food counter. A little bit smaller. 
Will you only be streaming discs or also making it into the edited to the series? For now, the plan is only to stream. Do you guys not have phones? I'm sorry if you don't have phones. Okay, that's a bit big. That outline. Almost done, guys. Sorry. This is really important, I can tell. This is really important to this hack. Okay, I think that'll do. Food counter a little bit smaller. There you go. Perfect. We need a food counter. Okay. Food counter has been made. So they talked about bread and cheese. And they talked about celebrating with fine fish and bread. I wonder what other recipes are in this game. Food is important. Anyway. It's now a somber and disheartening time. Lord Gradden's hefty tax increases had leave commoners without food or joy to spare. That doesn't count. That doesn't count. The jovial grins and overflowing baskets usually present at spring gatherings are now sudden frowns and desperate pleas. Is the gang all here? Or Katie is late. Shh, not surprised. Vagalus, did Arcady send word of his arrival? Night follows upon us. We need to move out soon. They really went in on a medieval speak here. He'll be here. Hey there, sorry I'm late. You wouldn't believe the trip I had to get here. My god. Oh, it looks like his head is <laughs> on backwards a little bit. <laughs> Peace, cousin. Well met. Vagalus, you're looking huge. Who could have thought that all that scrawny rabbit would help you bulk up? I still can't believe you enjoy such a lean game. Never did have much taste for it myself. Hey, that was food. That was food. Rabbits are food. There you go. Three foods. That's because your cooking is atrocious. Is that new food? I think that's the same food. Arkady, what news do you bring from the south? Right. Grand's men are multiplying. <laughs> They're breeding like rabbits. They're levying heavy taxes and offering nothing in return. Those dastards. They're jailing people who resist or simply cannot pay. Not sure how much longer my family will be able to hold out without food. Not like any of the folks have ever made much coin to begin with. I see. Even in a rural state like Bolaro, the farthest reaches are unsafe from Gradin's grasp. It appears the situation grows more dire for all of us with each passing day. Indeed. It's crazy. The people are starving and the cushy aristocracy isn't pampered enough. They do nothing but take from people in order to line their pockets with gold and their stomachs with braised quill. That's food. I think that counts as food. Four foods. We have four foods. Alright, alright. Let's talk politics later. We should get a move on. What are we doing? Collecting taxes? Storch. This is one of the wealthier parts of town. It's a bit cut off from other sections, so there aren't many guards here. I'd wager there aren't more than a baker's dozen here. Right, we need to make sure we're stealthy. I'd rather avoid run-ins with the guards, but I doubt we're going to have much choice given the circumstances. Vagalus, Arcady, you know your positions? Yes, Arcady, let's fall in. I'm on it. Mom, where do I go? Why are we falling? Seems like a pretty stupid idea to me. Just stay near me, Lyra. Alright, I'll follow your lead. I'll cover you with the magic that my teacher, ta teacher taught me if you run into guards. Get ready, gang. Looks like a few houses haven't locked up for the night yet. Target them first. Remember to not hurt any of these innocents. Deal with the guards if they come at you if you can't avoid it. But remember that we can't stick around for too long in case more guards come. Just drop them blind. I'll lead the way out. Just be sure to stay close to me. Watch yourself. We're gonna rob houses. Let's go. Dun, dun, dun. What? Thieves? Two arms, man. Don't let them escape. General Leslie is personally patrolling this area tonight. Let us show her our value and curry favor with Lord Gradin. Is curry... Do we count it? Do we count curry, guys? We're gonna count curry as food? We will definitely handle these baseborn vagrants. Welcome to Vision Quest version 2. This is a complete version of the game containing 43 cha chapters. This was the one I was supposed to patch, I think. So here we go. No, not food? Okay, fine. Damn it. I know it's a normal word, I just like curry. Okay, fine. Anyway, 43 chapters, 32 mainline chapters, and 9 guidance. Be sure to check out the guide for info on game mechanics, lore, and full team credits. The team and I have worked hard to make this project come to life, and we've had a blast building and playing it over the years. Thanks so much for downloading, hope you have fun. Yeah, 43. I mean, you know, at least it's not 21. Please send over any and all feedback so we can continue to improve the overall experience. We will continue to push out updates and bug fixes as needed. Take care and enjoy. To escape this map and others later on, use the seize command with Storch on the flashing tile. This will successfully end the map. Alright, that'll do. Well, it looks like we've been noticed by the, by some guards already. I'll take a moment at the units in a minute. Let me just see how this all looks. Alright, so it's a pretty small map. A couple of enemies over here that... Not too many of them in number right now, so we can probably handle it depending on how awful our units are. Um, 
The music I don't recognize personally, but apparently it's Street Fighter music, or so chat says. Uh, I want to get the unit guide on my screen just in case I'm missing something. I don't. You know, I know you guys won't be able to see. Just like a text that was like recruitment stuff. I'll just have it on my screen just in case you need to check it, so you don't have to look for it later. Uh, games, Fire Emblem, Hacks, Vision Quest. I know chat's got me covered. It's fine. I just want to have it handy. Okay. Okay. This is no no recruits here. Okay. Good to know. Okay. So let me just take a look at what I've got. Let me do the options. This 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 is all good. Uh, this off, I guess. Okay, so Arcady, Storch, Lara, Sphere, and Vagless. Okay, I'm assuming this is the main lord because he has the seas. Storch, a brawler, farmer from Bolaro, he fights for his family. Hello, Sela. <laughs> Let's check out the guide for more food. <laughs> okay, fairly balanced bases. I can't really say a whole lot about like, how good or bad these stats are, you know, considering we, I don't know how strong the enemies are. Leadership Star is nice, of course. Um, Charisma and Shove. I think all units have Shove, if I recall. Someone said that. So that's nice. The Cod's Bugger, which is personal blade. I think it's with cavalry and armor. So that's a kind of like a rapier ish kind of thing. Looks good. Okay, what else we got? Arcady, a woodcutter from Blaro, Vagless's cousin. Oh, yeah, this, is, this game loves personal weapons. Yeah, Devi, I, uh, so I've read. Thank you. I've read. Let's see, we got Iron Axe and Vigafu Personal Hatchet. Reaver, okay, so that's good against Swords then, okay. Doesn't get weighed down or anything. No special things. Here's a talk conversation. I assume we're gonna do that at some point. Jaunt the Loam and Shove. This is minus two. At least I know these skills from like other games, so that's helpful. Alera, Esphere's Daughter, Wind and Fire. Uh, oh, this is her personal tome, old and worn out. Okay, so it's gonna break after 20 uses, I guess. That's the, that's what it means. Miracle survives if over 50% HP and shove. Okay, you got shove too, right? Like all you just have shove. Yeah, okay. Uh, S fear talks a sword. She's fast. She's a thief. Some sort of ruby sword doubles the weapon triangle. Okay, it will take me a long time to get used to this. Don't mind me though. A pass. Steel and cunning. Okay, so basically just pass is all I gotta remember really, and it's like, easy to remember. And Vagless. Alright, let's see. I said bow fighter. It's got a good old iron bow. I'm assuming these are mostly unchanged. It's a little stronger than vanilla iron bow, I think. So that's kinda of whatever. Is this oh there's Nihil, okay. Arcadia's personal is one two. Uh who's the oh yeah, the the hatchet? Yeah. Yeah, okay, good to know. Alright, so what kind of enemies are we looking at here? Just to give myself a rough idea. That's not too different from FE7 enemies, for example, so I can just keep that in mind. Like, they're not massively buff. Oh, an Axe Mercenary. They're just fast Axe users. Gaming. Okay, well, let's let's see what we can do here. So, we got a lot of talks to do. What kind of attacking performance do we have here? Okay, so we're like two at killing enemies here. Not really doubling with anyone. I probably assume the Thief doubles. One rounds even, damn. I mean, we don't need to, because we got plenty of units here. Apparently we have to be somewhat quick to avoid reinforcements, and we gotta rob some houses. Which is like here, here, here. Three houses. Four houses. That's not too bad. One here. Uh, so we can probably have Bow Guy take care of that. Four turn. As long as you take care of this fighter. Okay, let's see. Do make sure I combine for kills and everyone. A slim sword. Okay, I have to like take a counter from one of these. It might as well be that one. I also want to do the talk combos as much as possible. I got a couple ones to do here. Uh, I'm not gonna do yours, cause I'm gonna have you kill this archer here, and then move back up. Probably all the way through here. Let's just go here. Yeah, you're gonna go there. There's a ton of talk combos. I noticed. Yeah. Okay, I'm. I'm just gonna warn you, chat, I'm not gonna make optimal moves. It's my first playthrough. And if you're here for optimal moves, you're watching the wrong blind person. Okay, let's just see what we got here. Alright. Classic FE remix music. As for your starting level, it's high. Oh, it's nine. Yeah, you're right. That's that's pretty high. You're right. Okay, I'll just uh, I'll just avoid the counter here probably and then take the kills with the other two. 
Like you can like one round, right? Almost one round. So yeah, you can you can finish off here. Okay, sure. We'll just we'll just do this. Check growths. Okay, sure. I don't like to look too hard at growths because you know they're random, and I, I, there was a lot to look at anyway. Okay, so you can take this now. Uh, is this in range? The archer? No, right? Nope. Nope. Okay. All good. Let's do this. Yeah, I heard they're like 50-50 over, all over the place. Nice crit. Stealables. Okay. Will do. Uh, right now I don't see any stealables though. Uh, I mean, I see a Vaughn, I guess, but... I'm not gonna go out of my way to steal every single Vaughn if you don't mind. Okay, let me look at growth real briefly. Okay, kind of expected. Alright. Yeah, like, okay, this, this isn't, isn't really, not really gonna change the way I play with these characters, you know, but I'm just curious. But it's a ROM hack, they usually make everything kind of balanced. So, yeah. Okay, now I know they're gross. It doesn't really change anything. Let me do the talk. Might as well. Never don't fall behind. We can't afford to move slowly. I'm here. You. All this running is exhausting. Are you okay, dear? Please tell me. I'm fine, Mom. Really. Please don't worry. I'll stay near. Are you certain? Yes, Mom. Heck, I'm not a kid anymore. You gotta fend for myself. I'll be fine. You let me visit the teacher for months at a time without being around. What's so different if I'm a few leagues behind you? This is a battlefield. I can't ensure your safety if you don't stay close. I can assure my own safety. With my tome, none of these guards scare me. Watch me go. <laughs> there, wait. Hold up. You can't see what you can't vision. No, this is on normal mode. And a heck counter. I don't have room for a heck counter. There's, always, there's already so much food here. Okay, so three, four. These are all moving. They're all on the move. Oh, Fakeless. It's a buff, man. Food. Okay, suddenly this got really busy. Kind of feel like retreating now because it's too much to handle right now. Oh, this this we can handle. You can enemy phase these, right? Eleven. There'll be a chance of death if you face them all. Uh, we can. Okay, I think I know what I'm doing. I think he is going here to fight at least one fighter, and he can technically probably take a hit from this. I don't want him to. I don't want him to, so probably just move him back a little bit too. And these two gang up on this guy. Probably. I can also use her to fight these guys though. Uh, Arkady, how bulky are you? 5 defense only? Yeah, he's kind of screwed. Bones are buffed, so they're like 15. Um, yeah, I'm probably just gonna play it chill. Actually, I can do... Okay, I think I know what I'm doing here. Hopefully you don't get hit here though. That'd be kind of bad. Oh, you're still fine. I can just cover. I can cover. It's fine. Let's do this. Ow. Like a soul situation with the Jig and Thief. Well, this one is level 9 unpromoted. It's a little bit different. If you're to use the Ruby Sword, it's not a personal. Oh, it's just really good. Okay, fine. We'll use it. I'll use it to put this one enemy face because it's going to be kind of tight. All right, so you see he's covered. Uh, we can use... I mean, we don't have to care about these guys that much. But I want to move out of range of this guy anyway, so... Uh, what I'll do probably is get this talk convo while we're here. You think Lyra should be out here? This isn't exactly something any of us are proud of. Not to mention the danger. If Marlon knew, it'd break his heart. There are greater problems for that boy, if it is the truth. That breaks his heart. You don't feel any sort of shame? I'd rather my daughter see where, our daughter, where the money comes from, rather than waste her time guessing. No sense in hiding where a forced hand reaches. Yeah, that makes sense. I worry about being able to protect Marlon. Storch, you're only doing your brother a disservice by keeping this a secret. He's 15, he's not a child anymore. He's the same age as Lyra. Yet they're so different. Let's keep moving. Okay. Let's go here. I'm gonna hoard my Vaughn. And also move him back a little bit. He's out of range of this guy. Uh, you have five move, right? But yes, I did equip the Ruby Knife. Look, it's okay, because the, the Thief gains extra experience, so it's fine. I'm allowed to uh, to get extra points with it. Uh, five move is what I'm checking for, right? Yeah, five move. One, two, three, four, five here. Let's go back a little bit. 
I think this is actually one square too far, but it's completely fine. Okay, so you're going for him. You didn't double, right? It's fine, though. We can follow up with someone else. Yeah, a lot of people played this hack, apparently. Or so I've been told. Okay, it's good that this guy's out of the way. I was getting a little busy in here. Okay, so this is also an ideal matchup. It is a really good matchup. It's a really good hack as well. <laughs> That's what I wanted to say. Okay, slowly getting control here. I think I can get through the house next turn. Or I can just heal. Both fine. I think I moved back one too far to get the house. Yeah, I can't get the house. I can get this archer though, right? Yeah, I can. No, I can't. Unless I shove, which I don't want to. I kind of want to though. I'm going to keep moving. I do want to get this house now before I'm moving out of the area. Like, he's the closest one to, to getting it. But I don't want to move him out of the way. Uh, If I go on the house, I can't be attacked yet. I really want to start getting houses here. Honestly, screw it. I'm going to heal this turn. And then they get the house next turn or something. It's fine. I probably don't need to plan this super elaborately. Yeah, I've heard Four Kings is very punishing. Who should get this one? I think the hatchet guy would be kind of cool for this. I just use this. Oh, I can't do that. Can you even kill this? This guy's actually kind of tricky to kill, isn't he? I have to use a wind here. Or use uh, Mummy Thief. Or use our... KD, and then build a soldier with Lyra. That works. I mean, the forking is just like really hard, even if you're not Iron Manning. That's what I heard. Okay, so I can't use the. I could actually I can use the swimming if I if I trade it, but I don't want to trade it. I want to do this. Five kings better than four kings, I agree. I know I don't have to hoard it. That's the thing about personal weapons in these hacks, is like you never know just how much you can afford to use them. Uh, I think I'll have to get to the house with you. Hmm, no one's home. Makes this all a little bit easier. There you go, get a red gem. We can sell on the black market for sure, knowing uh, how this hack goes. Or we can cook it, one of these two things. I'll... I guess I'll vaulm. What else are you gonna do, right? So let's see if nothing happens in this enemy phase. Like, absolutely nothing. Just trouble with a petty band of thieves. Pick up the pace, man. We must defeat them now. General Leslie will arrive soon. We must show her our worth. Oh, that's that's hack language for hurry up, game. We're gonna punish you. You don't move. That makes this a lot easier. He does move. Okay, let's... Push... These two. And go here, equip the personal, and heal when I can. Fortunately, I just took your Vuln, so you can't do that. What I can do, however, is go here, trade you the Vuln, and then go here. Oh, I guess I'm gonna have to choose between getting the village and getting the Vuln. Well, Vulling it is. I do speak hack language, yes. Very smart. Okay, we'll use the, the, the fire. I'm not gonna be able to attack with the thief anyway, it's fine. Go here and get this village. Huh? Who are you? Thieves? They come to this part of town? Please don't hurt us. Take whatever you want, please. Just leave us alone. Easy. Talisman. Ah yes, the red ball, my favorite. Alright, so you're going for my mage. Nice three shot. Is that the Thracia theme for battle? Yeah, we're the good guys, trust me. Here you go. Get magic and res, you know, the, the classic, the classic. Okay, you're still not moving. Let's go. Uh, can you kill... Okay, we'll use Mommy Thief. Oh, right, yeah, I've passed, that's funny. Funny ability. Well, I can't have pass and not use it, right? Come on. They were getting magic impossible. Look, they're like 45% growth. People call this coin flip emblem for some reason. Wait, did this just make no no sound with your XP bar? I think I think it was no sound there. Uh, I can I can shove Mr. Arcady so that the soldier attacks him. 
I think I will. So that means he has to go here and get shoved upwards by this guy. No more talks left, right? Yeah, no talks here. I think people talk to the archer guy. Let's give you the iron axe. Shove. And I guess she gets the house then. For almost forever, I'm still to get it. This looks like something we can use. Huh? Better get going. Stop! Thieves! Oh, you'll rule this day! Pure Watcher. It's okay, we're moving. We're moving. And I wish I had a healer though. Kinda hate spending my turns using phones when I want to get houses. <laughs> Alright, okay. Uh, I know one of you guys probably has weapon effectiveness against these uh, these calves. I think it's him. Yeah, he Oko's calves. That's really good. Uh, so I'm thinking is mage kills him. No matter what it takes. Uh, we can steal that fallen if we really want to. How bad is it if that we do that? Uh, we can even pass and get on the house, but... Let's see, this is 15. You don't have a hand axe or anything. I'm assuming Panna didn't do ambush fawns, so... We can also attack the armor knight. For free, if we block that way. It is normal mode. Like, I just I just took the advice of the creator by picking normal mode. And honestly, I'm fi I find it enjoyable so far. I think this is just about how hard I want maps to be, but it'll probably be, uh, get harder, but like... I like having to think a little bit, but not having to, you know, rack my brain for every turn, if you know what I mean, for like, chill streams. Uh, we could also put him here and then shove him and then kill the knight. But I want to steal that vuln, so... We're doing this, and then we're probably gonna... Actually, I'll do this, and then I'll shove him in range of the fighter block his uh, spot. Yeah, that works for me. Goodbye. Horses of Alm? Well, not anymore. What? Does horse count as, count as food? Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take this Alm this turn. Sorch is a very funny name, I agree. Yeah, let's shove him in the way. There you go. And Archer Guy, we can get started on him and then he'll die on any phase probably. Are you using the Ruby right now? Yeah, you are. Okay, that's good. Okay, let me get rid of this bot. Before they eat my food. Uh, hide. Goodbye. Okay, we'll take a bunch of damage, but nothing else can attack her as far as I know. Actually, no, we freed up the way, so the fighter can attack us. So we can actually die here. Which is kind of cringe. But... You know, we went in on it. Yeah, this is a misplay on my part. Oh, nice. <laughs> she lives anyway. <laughs> or maybe not. Maybe not. Hard mode is that because you die if you mess up. Yes, this guy's a favorite. We good. We suffer from success. A little bit. Just a little bit. Oh god, the sex bots repeating other people's messages. I'm glad they... Oh jeez. Why do you move now? Who made you move? Who made you move? Okay, that was a really late dodge. Is that Mario music? That's Kirby music. That's Kirby music. <laughs> I must have happened the other night. Oh, that's fair. Okay, well we don't have... We don't end the map by doing that. So, we all good. Turkin? Turkey? Food? Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. Okay, so we have three enemies to kill. One of them at full health. No one's good against the Merc, so we'll probably have to choke point the Merc. Um, this kills? No. This kills? Yes. I'm probably going to do this just because I get the talk out of the way. Sorry I dragged you into this. I had stooping to this level, but I gotta do it for my family. Hmm? What are you sorry about? I'm here for the same reasons as you. I know, I just feel grimy, but at the same time, what choice do we have? Whoa, starvation, death. Those are all options. <laughs> Gee, ever the optimist, eh, Vagless? If those are your options, stupid to this level is as bad as you think. Fair enough. Alright, take this kill before I change my mind. Mr. Archer. Yeah, I'm wondering if Dara can kill this boss. I think she can. I think with the wind, at least. Right? Uh, maybe not. I have to finish with someone else. I have to finish. I mean, you have an axe, right? So I can probably range it and then just go here. Just choke the point. 
hit the house with the thief. S3 can finish. S3 can definitely finish, but you can't feed kills to your Jagan around here. That's not allowed. Well, actually, oh, you can't reach. We have to finish with S4. That's okay. How much does S4 do? Uh, okay, we have to use Ruby to do six. No Fantage BS, right? No, just shove. Yeah. Just checking. Let's go. Oh, that's true. He can use his sword to get the kill. I have to fight the Merc with uh, my Thief, I guess. Just kind of crung. Alright, we'll just do that. Kill him up one range with the Mage. What, does the Mage kill him one range? No, she doesn't. I'm just gonna call this bar him. One, two, three, four, five, we're good. Here we go. Inferior, worthless. Ah. Is entitled to stream a bit too much? It's just it's just a play on on playing blindly. That's it. And on vision quest. I can Here you go. Okay, so you're not in range. Get this talk. I guess. Tell me, cousin, how are the parents? The old man's the same, but my old lady's starting to really grate me. I break my back all day cutting wood and trying to make some gold for them, but it's never good enough. That is unfortunate. Your mother is a lovely woman. It pains me to hear that she's stressed. Yeah, crazy as it sounds, getting out of town for a few days was just what I needed. Even if it is to do... this. I know this weighs heavy on your heart, cousin. Try not to let it bother you so much. If only I could be as stone-faced as you. You'll be mistaken for a statue with that attitude. We're cutting as good, honest work, but it doesn't pay, at least not with the taxes that are put on us. Think of it as the rich paying their share of fair their share of the tax then. They can afford it at least. Ha, the rich collect taxes and they're made into lords, while the poor collect taxes and they're labeled into labeled thieves. It's a cruel world, cousin. Just be glad you have this opportunity. Not everyone gets a chance. Cool. Cool story, bro. I think I did all the talks. Hmm. FE7 Victory Music Remake, kind of sounded like it, yeah. <laughs> Alright. This reminds me of playing The Last Promise more than FE7, to be honest. I couldn't tell you why. Glad this hack isn't political. All games are political, guys. In fact, everything is political. If you can't deal with that, you know, the door's over there. Ooh, an iron sword. How neat. I don't know if I get a prep screen anytime soon, but I might just trade it over to my thief next turn. Uh, I don't know. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna get ambush spawn, am I? Uh, I need to seize with Storch. Actually, he needs to go there. So let's have him go there. Run. Actually, I should give that to my thief. Come to think of it, my my lord, my lord. Uh, you can actually reach, so you should take it now. Take it while well, you still can. You get my phone. You get my house. You get preps? Okay, nice. What are you doing? Just who are you? Please don't hurt me. My parents are out of town. You're the ones with the money. You should find them. They never give me anything anyway. They tried to make me go to church instead. Do I look like someone who needs gold? I have rich parents. Here, take this dumb rock and leave me alone. Goddess icon. Hello. Ooh, gaming. Using the general to collect taxes and prisoners. What is Lord Granon thinking? And are these thieves? No matter. I will fulfill my duty. These dastards will rue the day they cross my lands. That woman. She looks like the high-ranking official. She's charging right for us. Quick. Gotta get out of here. Head to the forest. Everyone get out, every Soldiers. In my Fire Emblem hack. They get weighed down by javelins, but not by their iron lances. FP7 is a good game. It's a fun game. Okay, so... He's fine against these soldiers. If he wants to be. Kill Lance, not a big fan though. That's a lot of crit you got there. I wonder if she's supposed to make me get out of the chapter. Death blow, yeah. Gee, let's not let's not fight her too much. But I'll farm her soldiers for XP for a second. While we wait with uh, Stotch. <laughs> Stotch guy. Door for XP. I, I would like to. I like how this is not a fog of war map, but it's clearly at night. My favorite fog of war map. 
Yeah, four leadership is uh, kind of kind of strong. Okay, so y'all can reach here. How much attack do you have with the Javi? Only three mites. The classic DS emblem. Twelve attack. So we're taking seven each. So we can definitely get some XP here if we position correctly. We can take one with Arcady and his personal weapon. Or the other way around, actually. Uh, watch out for her, though. Let's do this one. Get the thing here. And then we can put Archer, like, here. To take the other one, if he if he's so inclined to do that. Oh, he has a Reaver, right. Oh, uh, that's a problem. Let's give him a better option, then. Let's give him this option. Maybe they'll go for it. I made it oopsie. It is Reaver. I'm not used to this game, guys. Forgive me. This is what happens in a blind playthrough. Oh, you're just you're just gonna do coward things, okay? Okay, we're escaping this turn. Or you can run away. Or you can run away. I was used to the Pucci. Let's see. You got six moves, so they're ahead now. So we can't stand in range anymore. So just gotta take our, our kills that we can get. Cause this is uh, obviously not the play. I'll take this one soldier kill. Probably all I can get. Oh, he doubles. Neat. That would have been really nice to have. Um, do you double soldiers? No, not this one at least. I think he doubles when they have a javelin. Well, I'll take this. Mm. F11 javelins are actually stronger than F12 javelins. Or rather, than F11 iron lances. Maybe able to get two. I mean, if I use S Fear, maybe. Emphasis on maybe. S Fear would need to be healed. I, did, well, I wasn't willing to use a Vaughn here just to get her healed, so. The answer is no. Also, I forgot to trade the Iron Sword. The backflip, though. You have a Soth backflip. Yo, defense and res. We got plus two res on Lyra, so basically we have to use her. That is how the world works. I don't make the rules. Yo, XP. Boss XP. You die, right? Like, there's no way you live. Yeah, she dies. She can also double the weapon triangle, right? That's pretty good. Oh, it's only bonus, okay. Let's just get our chip damage and get out of here. I don't need boss XP. I don't even need an adult relating. I don't even need an adult's dating site. Bite. Alright. Peace out, game. Seize. Did everyone make it out okay? We should be far enough now that they won't find us. Yes, we're all here. That woman, she's General Leslie. She's Lord Gradin's right hand. What's she doing out here? Who knows, but if she saw us, we were in for a rough time. If she did, we'll find out soon enough. Thagless, you're as dour as Jilted Maiden. Is Jilted Maiden, is that food? You're probably right though. We should lay low regardless. I agreed. We made a decent enough howl. Storch. So guys, already streams, same as always. Wednesdays, Saturdays, same time. Actually, I, uh, for 50 minutes earlier than I actually started. Hmm, it's nothing. We should all go back and get some rest. We're getting close to the outskirts now. Vagelis, Arkady, you both know the way back? Yes. Arkady, you can stay with me tonight. Gee, I thought you were going to send me home. What a guy! Maiden isn't food. Oh, I thought it was, like, supposed to be some kind of, uh, food. Like, food slang. Kind of like, you know... A Virgin Mary is like a cocktail, right? But it's also a human being. Thanks, cousin. I hope your mom has some of that stew left over. I'm starving. None if I have anything to do with it. <laughs> We're heading back to... Yeah, Bloody Mary. We're heading to... Heading back to... Wait, did he just say food? Did I miss it? Oh, he said stew. He said stew. Alright, food. Food. Five foods. Food plus one. We're heading back to Storch. Are you all right on your own? Mm, yeah, I'll be fine. Thanks, S. Fear. It's no problem. Watch yourself. You too. Bye, Storch. Get home safe. Bandits. Are we bandits? Does this make us bad? Does every everyone who played this just go? Are we the baddies here? Is that what you do if you're a gamer? Because that's the kind. Of, that's the meme that popped in my head first, which feels like too obvious of a joke. Heck, I just want my family to be safe. If this is what it takes, then so be it. I mean, we're the goodies. We're blue, right? We're the goodies. We're the bandies. Perspectives. 
Oh god, where did the story go, bandits? Oh no, we're gonna get killed by Lin now. The glorious countryside is a diverse landscape, hosting hills, forests, and rivers alike. The paths along its southwestern border leading to the state of no Nabokov, adjacent to the heart of the Naves Nafanes Empire, are dotted with rolling hills and mountains. In previous years, merchants purchased from the sea traders in the eastern ports bring their wares, wares further inland. In these trying times, with satchels devoid of coin, those who seek gold must venture elsewhere, head through the foggy mountain pass. We're all here, Storch. What's the word on tonight? Pickpocketing more wealthy folk? Not tonight. S3 has news. There's a merchant caravan passing through here tonight. It's a small caravan, but they have no guard. They'll be an easy target. We'll strip them for what they're worth and send them back home. No guard? It's clear they're not from around here. Or it's a trap! I'm just saying. Who cares? It makes our lives even easier. Yeah, but we gotta be careful. We're not the only folks doing this kind of thing. A lot of people are getting into this line of work with the taxes and all. Sorch is right. I don't think merchants will be the issue. It's the other bandits. Tell me, Esfir, how'd you come up with this information? This group of bandits... Merchants is not from Balaro. They're from Balti, the imperial capital of Navan. They come to Balaro to pawn off what shouldn't, wouldn't sell in the capital. But they couldn't cut a profit here either. I overheard them at the tavern. They knew Balaro was not the richest, but this level of destitution, they did not foresee it. With that, they're heading back earlier than expected. They're in a hurry. Hence why they didn't think to get a guard. Amateurs. But wait, if they couldn't sell anything, how do we know they have money? The merchants from Balti are as wealthy as Valerian nobles. They are gladly part with gold to make us go away, I'm sure of it. Rich and arrogant. Makes it a bit easier to swallow then. Quite. Storch, we should head out soon. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> ah yes, the fog. I can see it now. Oh hello, you look vanity. We've got them now, Gherkin. Those merchants are trapped. I sent some men around to pounce in the pincer room. Nice work, Cutter. My prediction, we're gonna fight the bandits and save the merchants. You'll earn your keep in no time. Sure the boss will be impressed. Could I ask though, why do you all call me Cutter? My name is James. Because you're a woodcutter. Or at least you were before you came to us for work. It's tough times and this job pays well if you got stones. Besides, ain't no brigand gonna take orders from James. Men already look up to you. You gotta play the part. Remember, you wouldn't need to do this if it weren't for Gradin. He took your money, and he took your name, too. That's right. Those dastards. They took what's ours. I'll show him. Exactly. Take back what's ours. Lead the man, and ransack those pompous whelps from Balti. That's right. You're right, Gherkin. I'll destroy them all. Will you be joining us? I've got other business that needs my attention. You know what our boss gets. Orland's, get Orland's got no patience. I'll see you back at the base, with riches in tow, eh? Of course. I can do this. Thanks, Gherkin. I'll see you then. Well, that was easy enough. No seeds of doubt is gonna bloom with me around. Cutter, you really ain't cut out for this worker thing. This is basically the Dorcas dialogue. <laughs> but that's not my concern. Gotta watch my own back. Time to see what else Orland's got in mind for work. Hey, it's Merlinus's. They're sitting ducks. At first I felt bad for stealing, but now they're making me feel bad if I don't. They may as well leave the gold out on their front porch for us. I don't think it'll be so easy, cousin. Look, we have company. What? I can't see through this fog. Bandits. Esfir was right. We didn't gonna rob him too? We were here first, that's not fair! I don't think it works like this, Lyra. We should beat them up! I really don't want to get into another fight. Too bad, you're playing Fire Emblem! Actually, Storch, Lyra makes a good point. If we're to swoop in and fight the bandits, we may get a reward. As for your slight cougar, your slight cougar, that's that's enough for work. Can you eat cougars? No? Okay. It seems dishonest, but to be fair, we were gonna steal from them. So they don't give us a reward. We can rob them blind anyway. It's the best course of action. Alright, let's get ready for a tussle. Remember that our goal is to defend the merchants. Don't let anyone near him. Defend map, alright. Okay, so... Guys, I have a question, right? So this is a fog of war, right? Fog inhibits your vision. So if I move into it... On my quest... I'll get more vision. Right? 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 Okay, anyway. I, d I thought you needed that joke. Anyway. Yeah, I just beat the game, yeah. <laughs> it's the final chapter. <laughs> uh, I can move my thief around to see a little bit more. Alright, there we go. <laughs> Pure gum punching! <laughs> I solved the puzzle. <laughs> FBI I opened up. <laughs> okay, so we need to defend the band, uh, the merchants, but they're far away. So I'm assuming they're not going to get there right away. Uh, I assume if I put, like, 
my dude here with an iron sword, he can tank these bandits a little bit. Uh, is this like DS emblem where terrain is shitty? Oh no, it's, sh it's not shitty, it's shitty-ish. Just pretend it didn't have- <laughs> we have obtained a vision quest. I mean, we have a torch, we literally have a torch. It's gonna come in handy. Okay, Slim Sword is kind of cringe, but you have to work with this for now. I like to get, I like to keep people with their initial inventories for a little bit at least, because it feels like the game intended me to have them that way. I love the early preps, by the way. This is so nice. Uh, we can even, oh, we even have an armory. Wow. I don't know who's like serving me this, but this is super nice. Thanks for this super quality of life. I hate early inventory management. I know what's gonna happen with this pure water. I just know I want my thief to be free to steal stuff. I even have to supply. Damn. I don't need this right now, right? Yeah, I can buy more iron swords. Are they, are they cheap? Oh, they're cheap. Nice. Cool. Uh, I could get one on that sphere, I guess. Uh, I don't know who's good for these stat boosters. I kind of want to hold on because I don't know yet who I'm using for long term. But once I pick like a favorite, I can give them those stat boosters. Is that okay, chat? Can I hoard my boosters without you guys going pitfall, pitfall, pitfall? I can, right? I can do that. Uh, I would like an iron sword right, then, I guess. Say screw to some sword. That's legal. Okay, good. I like it being legal. I would also like a Vaughn. I think this army does not sell Vaughns, though. It does sell Vaughns. Damn, this is a nice one. You want the Vigalus? I mean, he's pretty cool, but I don't know if he's cool enough yet. Okay, I can share that one Vaughn I'm missing. That's fine. I guess I gotta play this before I watch Mecha play it. Fair, understandable. Enjoy. Okay, so we know this band is there. I'm just gonna fight them with, um, with Storch and his iron, his trusty iron sword. And meanwhile, we'll see what comes through the fog on the other side, and we'll go from there. If all the merchants die, you will get a game over. All of them. Damn. That's savage. Okay, just gonna play a little bit de defensively, because I don't know what I'm up against. Let's go... Let's go in the house, might as well, right? It gives a void, I think. I'm, I would visit it if I had the time, but right now, I just wanna... I just wanna see vision. I just wanna... I just wanna complete my vision quest. Oh, this is busted in this game too. It's GBA, it should be. Oh, that's really nice. Um, okay, so with these mages here, I actually kind of want to pure water either one of these two so they can counter the mages. Like, maybe not right now, but soon. So I'm gonna go here. I could probably have shoved in some more optimal way, but screw it. This is a familiar theme. Uh, if I shove here, I can shove backwards. Fuck it, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna leave you here just in case you need to shoot a bandit. S-rank bow hidden near the caravans. It's on the forest c case northeast of most caravan. Those are fine hints to give me, by the way. I'm fine with knowing hidden items. Uh, I heard they're not that good, but like kind of good, so that's fine. Anyway, what? You gotta be kidding me. There's another group of bandits here? No matter. Kill them all. Take them all for what they've got. We also got one of the fancy archers on our side. He's got this fancy bow that'll stick him real good, right where it hurts. Some more of our boys are on the way. We'll get them from all sides. Oh no, that's not good. Is it houses and chapters? I would like some hidden items, yes. Alright. I'll take a hidden items or 100%. Oh, it's a Pegasus. A battle in this place? Those merchants look like they could use some help. A soldier from Makala never backs down. This is what I've learned during my time. Uh, how bad are these merchants anyway? I'm glad they have faces. Okay, so they're not getting doubled. I'm not getting O code. 15 and 3. Uh, he might he might be some trouble. I take it you don't wander out mages, you new, new girl. Lady Blade, gaming. Well, you can block at least. I'm glad you use his sword. That's really nice of you. What do you got? Lightweight. When holding three or less items, attack speed plus three. I love these abilities. They're funny. Uh, Natsako. A fresh recruit from Makala. Dutiful yet sneaky. Uh, yep, those are growths, for sure. Lady Blade, D-Sword, Effective versus Thieves, Pirates, and Brigands. Wait, Effective? You mean... Oh, that's a free kill. I love free kills. They're my favorite. Uh, I probably need to detect the mage and watch the Brigand suicide, right? Because if I go here, I block his path to the caravan, and this guy has no choice but to attack a caravan in my range. Okay, um, Crisis Resolved. Yeah, it's not a personal. That's... It looks like a personal, because, you know, it has a personal name. It's on a unit, <laughs> but it's not. Yeah, I'll just use it for a little bit. Men can use the Lady Blade? That's sexist. I don't know how, but that is sexist, for sure. Okay, so... Looks like we got it under control for now. Could even go on the offensive here. 
I want to use this. Why is it weaker than Iron Axe? That's, that's what annoys me. I know it's ranged, but damn. I guess we can do this now. Because this part is like kind of empty. I guess I can go here now. I can even go for it. I'm going to go for this. I want to save attacks. I love flyers and fog. I sure hope there's no archers. I mean, he just warned me about one archers at least, so. I don't know what the, whether he meant like a ballista or a killer, or a killer arch, but we should, we'll see. I might just visit this house for the hint. Um, you still don't double, right? Yeah, you don't double. How about we see what's up in here before anything else? Um, I'm gonna shove. I'm just gonna see. Okay, there's nothing here. But bait for the pickings. 12 and 12, and there's a mate here. I'll take my chances. I'll fix it the house with the axe guy. Did you get the pure water on you? Yeah, I did. Okay, so I'm gonna, I can move him over there and get the mages. Sure, that seems good. Yeah, wind is more might and fire. Wind is a personal tome. It's like seven might. I don't get it either, but we'll take it. It's gonna take some getting used to, but that's fine. Dun, 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 dun. Well, the idea is that the wind is so strong that you can't fly around, right? That's the idea with wind being fixed. Oh, Pogger's level up on my lord. We'll take it. We'll take it. Let's get this house. I want to see what it says. Hey, it's Anna. It's not uncommon to find items on the ground. This merchant's probably dropped something valuable. If you wait near them, you might find something rare. I feel obliged to return it to them. <laughs> I doubt they'll even notice. Okay, so near the merchant, so like the 3x3 three three that someone said. Ow. Don't be like that. Oh no. My storch. Make sure turn one flyer plays and punishes them. Well, not in this case. Make these jokes in every format. Pokemon warrants you. Well, I wasn't going to, but now that you say that it annoys you, I might do it anyway. Hello. Not punished. Not no punishing flyers. Uh, I can't reach shucks. I'll just take out this bandit enemy phase then. Uh, no forest for you if I go here, right? Yeah, no forest for you. Let's just take out the mage, it's fine. If you attack the bandit from the right in turn one, Natsuga would get longboat and instantly die. But it also wouldn't have blocked... That also wouldn't have blocked the merchant, so it wouldn't have been a bad play regardless. Let's see if we can find that thing. But like, yeah, please don't tell me that stuff. I, I, now, I don't, now I know there's a longboat that I wouldn't have known otherwise, so please don't tell me that kind of stuff. Um... So, Thief Mom can weaken and kill with the Vague guy. Uh, I didn't use my Pure Water yet. I think you won on this mage now, right? Yeah, you do. That's kind of poggers. What do I want to do then if I'm not doing that? I kind of want to move him like into this forest over here to see what else is up here. I know watching me do that is half the fun of Iron, which is why I don't, which is why I prefer to stay blind. You know, I know it says I'm on a quest for vision. Nice kill, S fear. I'll oh, steal the phone. Oh, I didn't even notice he had a phone. My bay. Again, if you're here to watch me play perfectly, I'm sorry to disappoint, but it's not gonna happen. I'm playing blindly. I don't have this knowledge. I don't think there's anything there actually. But I'm still gonna sneak through this fog. Like it's it's my business to be cautious. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm just gonna go here. Like, screw it. There's nothing here. Like, if there's something here, it's like a cavalier or something. Which I don't think there is. Let's just go around the, the long way. Uh, do we shove him up? Yeah, sure, why not? Shove is a little bit hard to get used to in GBA. And, like, we all have five move units. Oh, hello. Okay, now you need to, like, dodge something. Here you go. <laughs> Monochrome vision. Oh, we're facing two of these. Well, they have blue pants, so they're supposed to be good guys, right? Yes, yeah, so if I'm playing blind, I don't have vision. Exactly, Morg. You get it. Ah, yes, a longbow. So surprising. Oh, look, a good level up on my Pegasus. Easiest Pegasus ever. Easy XP. This is like the opposite of Florina. Why am I one strength off of one of Kyo and Bandits? <laughs> now this is Pogger Gaming. She seems strong. Her strength growth is kind of cringe. It's like 35, but you know, she'll probably be good to stop of flying alone if you... The thing is, flyers get better if you're not playing blindly, so actually for me, flying bad. Uh, I don't want to scout with my flyer alone, so I'm just gonna like try and pick up that thing. They said it was near the merchants. Let's try here or something. Nope, that's not it. Uh, now I'm in range of the longbow, so let's hope I kill here. I didn't use my pure water yet, so yeah. 
Goodbye. Are you a tier list stream used so far? Well, I don't have a tier list maker ready, but I can make one. There's probably one on the internet somewhere that lets you tier. Okay, the thing is, the reason I don't want to do this is because if I open a tier list maker, it'll uh, it'll show all the recruitable units portraits, which I don't really want to. I know it seems like a minor thing to get spoiled over, but I don't want to like look at a boss you see early and be like, oh, that guy's recruitable actually, and then I'll be spoiled. So probably won't be doing that. Uh, okay, so you're facing one guy. That's manageable. There's one guy coming from here. We can't face him yet, so he'll just be left to someone else then. Actually, if I shove... Can I get there? I can face him if I shove twice, probably. Because I need to cross one, two, three, four, five, six. We need one tile of shovements. Shovements, that's a, that's a term now. Here you go. Now we can make it. I can even shove him onto the thing, can't I? No, I can't. Never mind, I couldn't. Probably could have if I planned better, but I didn't. So you can go here. Safely. Have a guy make a custom tier maker for you with just the units you know. Uh, sure, if someone like, feels like doing it. I'm not gonna ask people to put in the work for me. Do I think it's bad design? I mean, if it's a quick reset, not really. Like, it's kind of mean, but they warned you about the longbow. So you knew something like that was coming. Okay, I really want to get this kill with her, because he's not killing anyway, because he's cringe. So I guess he's going back to item finding duty. I don't know where it is, though. Oh, wait, can I even see it anymore? Shit, I think I lose, I lose vision on him. Um, yeah, this S rank, we'll get that later. It's funny how they give you S rank so early, but I guess you might as well, because it's not going to, like, matter. Uh, but, like, you can't see anything here. I'm still going to move the thief first, because I don't know what else is coming here. Uh, I don't want to use my cuts bulger for no reason. We can... I mean, we don't have to wrap this up right now, but... Fine to do so, I think. Get the bot with the Lady Blade, it was super effective. I'm actually false for the sec bots. It... I'm not sure what the how they work exactly, but if they didn't work, they wouldn't be here. The bot was a bandit, yeah. I mean, it's effective against bandits and thieves, you could argue they're thieves. Also, I think I can reach, right? No, I can't reach. Unless I shove, but I want to use my thief to move, so... That ain't gonna be it. Okay, let's move my thief first. See a couple bandits coming down. I don't think you one round thieves, so I'm actually kind of okay with uh, Jig and Thief going like here, taking this spot. Hello. Nice to see you guys all here. Let's go here. Take this one out on player face so he doesn't get to attack me. Yeah, I too love the XYZ domain. Alright, so far so good. Nice tame map design. You think it's boring, but it's not. It's fun to like get used to your units a little bit. We could shove upwards. I don't need to though. And then I, I would give him the force for free actually. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's go here. It's nice when you can shove, when you have nothing else to do. It's really nice. It's really nice. Next Bismix collaboration. Uh, I don't know. Um, Biz was very busy making his FE4 video and with his, you know, his own social life. Uh, but I know he said at some point he might be up for another safe Pokemon Nuzlocke, so maybe that'll be another thing. I'd have to ask him. Let's see. Smart Iron Sword, Iron Land, so nothing special here. He hasn't said his line yet where he's like, oh, I'm about to move and crush you, so let's assume he does not do that for now. I don't have anything good against a soldier here, I just have like three sword users and a bow user. Very cringe. Can you use lances at all? No. Okay. Understandable. Have a nice day. So, I mean, you don't have to have open triangle to fight an enemy. Right? I don't have to. I'm allowed not to have open triangle. Just a little bit decision paralysis on where, where I'm gonna go. I know I'm not gonna expose my archer, so let's move him here. Go get him. Nice crit. Monster Hunter video? Probably. Oh yeah, Biz is also like retired from Fire Emblem, I guess. That's also a thing. Uh, we can probably put her here and she'll survive the bandit if she goes to full HP. I want to bait that soldier over, so let's do that. There's no way she's gonna... Oh, she needs a Vuln. Um, Let's go here. Share this Vuln with you. Shove. Any Vuln to steal here, by the way? I keep missing him, so... Looks like no. Yeah, there might be Lance Pags too. I don't know. Uh, shove here, I suppose. And 
I saw a talk earlier. Oh, that's between you two, right? Let's, let's get that one. Let's get it. Huh? Pegasus Knight, who are you? I am Natsuko, a soldier from Makala. Mahala. I was here to deliver a message. I was heading back to the south to catch a boat back, but then I saw this scene break out. Tell me, who are you? I'm Storch. We could use an extra hand fighting off these bandits. Of course, let's work together. Alright. Standard fare. Um, there's no real reason to go anyway here. Oh, right, you have to supply. That's so nice. An extra phone. How neat. Um, I'll gladly take that. Oh, yeah, I'm vaguely aware of the system of this game of promotions where, like, some classes, they share a common promoter class, right? So also the forest. Yeah, that's another one I want to do. Uh, the problem is it's made by Skryza, and Skryza is the god of Fire Emblem, basically. Oh, I didn't know you were in range. That's fine. So I know if I can handle the Souls of the Forest, but we'll see. I know there's multiple difficult cooldown modes as always, but damn. Okay, is there anything left to do here besides, you know, killing these enemies? Like, I got the I got the S-rank bow. That's all, right? Um, go here. Yeah, rooting promotion tree, yeah. <laughs> well, no offense, Crash, but like, I don't know. What I've heard about, about Four Kings is not really something I feel like playing right now. I know it exists, though, don't worry. At one point, I might try it. Um, sure, we'll just one range it. It's fine. Goodbye. Dun, 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 dun. Here you go. And I guess I'll bait the Merc. I'm kind of playing it slow here. I could go next to him. I want to go faster. Can we take these hits? Oh, pass is so good. We can actually take all the hits here. As long as we don't attack. Can we kill? No, we're one short. Unless I shove the Pegasus Knight off, but that's not an option. Uh -huh. We can go here so that none of these enemies get forests. I would like to attack, but it risks death. So let's let's do prop. Oh, we can shove the enemy. That's 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 just too good not to do. That's too funny. Funny moves only. Final destination. All right, here goes. They want to run the boss with the ruby, probably. But why would I want to? Oh, see, so we can want to run this guy instead. I was trying to set him up for someone else. Like, you gotta milk XP at this point, right? You gotta get your extra experience points. Extra experience points points. I heard Cold Black Knights is good. Yeah, someone really wanted me to play that one. You're stealing from us. I don't appreciate that one bit. No one takes from me. The Kirby music is an uh, interesting choice. <laughs> As for strength, yeah, gaming, gaming. Uh, this guy's not recruitable, right? There's no way he is recruitable. He's the boss. It's no way he's recruitable. Plus, the, the goal is to kill boss, so, like, gaming? Uh, I would like to keep leveling up my lore, personally. That's always a safe choice. Uh, so we can just kill, right? There's nothing I'm missing here. No no big things. I did get the S rank bow. Cutter got cut from the cast. <laughs> Alright, let's go. This was supposed to be easy. Why are you getting in my way? Stealing from emergencies merchants isn't right. I've got to do what's right. <laughs> oh ho, the brigand thinks he's part of the Imperial Guard? Ha, <laughs> I'll put you in the dirt. Oh, talk convos? Oh yeah, that's fine. Not gonna go back for that. They're taking what's ours. I'm getting Pogger level up so far. These level ups have been crushing. Are you all right? Yes, thanks to you. Your timing was impeccable. Oh yes, we are most gracious you could protect our rich. I mean, protect us. Indeed, but it begs the question, why are you militia man out, of, out at night so far and from town? Surely you have better things to do to patrol this area. Militia man? We only heard of the bandits in the area after you had left town. Came to make sure you were all right. I'm glad that none of you are harmed. I see. I suppose your noble deed deserves a reward. I didn't expect such generosity in Bolaro. Our time here has been most trying. This land is barn of gold. We've heard only Port Irene even bears the scent of it still. But never mind all that. 
You all deserve a reward for your kind generosity. Shut up, old man, and give me your kidneys. I mean, I only need one of his kidneys. That's not go overboard here. Please, take this as a thanks. This is wonderful. Thank you for the kind gift. It's a small price to pay us from those... <laughs> Is this a small price to pay for saving us from those ruinous brigands? Tell me, what are your names? Storch, this is Esphere. We'll remember that. Your exploits tonight will not be forgotten. Take care. Yeah, now we can recruit these in the final chapter. Gaming. This is quite a sum. Could you imagine what it looked like if we were able to get to go with the plan? You know, I thought being a good guy for a change would feel nice. But it doesn't. <laughs> let many things weigh on your mind, Storch. If you focus only on survival, you won't sweat minor trifles. Survival. Yeah, I get what you mean. Oh my god, this bot just keeps respawning. Thanks, Esphere. Try to remember that. You're new to this life. We all are. It is natural to stress and feel as you feel now. But think of the experience you've gained already. Think of all the level ups you got. Why? I bet you could travel, travel to other lands as a mercenary. Your swordsmanship has improved, and I'm sure you could sell your blade. No thanks. I just want to go back to how things were back on the farm. Even when we do the right thing, it still doesn't sit well with me. Not one bit. The money's nice and all, but it, if only to prevent my parents from struggling, but I don't want to do this much longer. None of us do, Storch. This isn't going to end until Granon eases his taxes. Taxes, taxes, taxes. It's either we resort to this or we starve. Food? Fagless already laid this out for you. Ha, huh, don't remind me. Anyway, we should head back to the town for the night. We're quite a ways from home, should we just stay at the inn? You know, the town is a great bar. I'm buying you an ale, Storch. Our drinks food, guys? Our drinks food? <laughs> Tax counter? There's an idea, but tax is just a plot point. <laughs> I'm buying you two things in life are inevitable. Taxes and food? We deserve it. We're heroes after all. Who could have thought? Drinks count? Alright, drinks count. Great. We get six. Six foods. Drinks are food? Who could have thought? A ragtag bunch like us being heroes. Pay to protect and serve is knights at the square table. They'll make stories about us. Heroes. Fire Emblem. Make that too. That's my cousin. Let's head back real quick before they close up behind you. They don't seem worried. Ease up, Storch. <laughs> Take it with a grain of salt. Arcady is no smarter than a stone. And Vagalus wouldn't flinch if it was on fire. They're not exactly the best people for me to compare to. <laughs> Became a cop by accident. Cop this game is cop again, that guy's. Wait, did he say cheese and wine? Do we need to add another one for the cheese and wine? Did I miss a cheese and wine? Salt? That's a food. Alright, we'll add one for either cheese and wine or food. Whichever one it is. Nevertheless, there is much you can learn from them both. And more importantly, there are friends and companions. Yes, mom. Let's go. I could use an ale too. Hey, sorry you got mixed up in all this. Got a good land to hand. Are you members of the local militia, as the merchant said? I'm not from around here, but I've never seen a group like yours. Not exactly, it's a bit complex. I mean, she helped us. You don't need to lie to her. Mataka, was it? We're citizens from a nearby town. Where Graydon, who rules the state, levied harsh taxes on the people here. We're tax fighters! We're anti-tax people! He's only, only increased the amount owed to the state, but the frequency that he takes gold and now other valuables like food! I mean, that she literally said food there. She literally said food. I don't make the rules. I don't make the rules. That's eight. She literally said food. If we can't pay, we're taken to jail. We do this to get enough money so we can protect our families. However, this time, it appeared helping the merchants was the better move. Esphere, isn't... Shouldn't we be more secretive about this kind of stuff? I mean, of all the... Oh, I understand, Storch. There's no need to hide. I appreciate your honesty. I'm a messenger from Mahala, the desert land to the south. I was en route home after delivering a message to a noble in the capital of Bolaro when I came upon this scene. We're lucky you arrived. Have you been a messenger for some time? No, I'm fairly new to this still. This was my first message to deliver in Navan. In Mahala's military academy, new recruits are trained as messengers before they enter into a combat unit. Well, now you're a combat unit. In my class, I was one of the last to get such an important assignment. But I still feel like I have much to prove to them and to myself. Gherkin should count. Is Gherkin food? Eh, I don't know. <laughs> the final boss is going to be Tax Lord. The final boss is going to be the IRS. Why don't you consider traveling with us for a while, Danetsuko? Are you serious? Like I said, I'm a low-ranking messenger, but I did finish my task with plenty of time to spare. Perhaps getting some additional experience and intel here is valuable. In fact, I might just do that. 
Besides, the mountain views in Navan from atop of Pegasus are stunning. Much better than the sea of sand you get back home. Natsuko, I think we're gonna get along just fine. Come now, the others are far ahead of us. Storch Esphere, thank you. I know I have a lot to prove, but you can count on me. I mean, as long as you don't die to an archer. Did I check our skills? I feel like I forgot to check our skills. I mean, she probably has shove, right? Brothers? One to three brothers. You have one to three brothers, Max. Villagers in Bolaro predominantly subsist through farming and fishing. Root vegetables, bread, and a river salmon steak or a coastal crab with herbs forest from the surrounding forest are frequent sites on their dinner tables. That's plus two food right there in my opinion. That's too much food for plus one. That's plus two food. That's so much food. Plus four? No, 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 no. A whole list of food is like, it's not quite like each of them individually, but that's a lot of food. Yeah. That five food points? Okay, you know what? You, you guys drive a hard bargain. We'll make, we'll do three food. But that, that's final offer. Three food. Yeah, this hack will just make you hungry. You can't play this hack for too long. Or you just get like too much food. Too much food hunger. Oh, lightweight. I did check it. Yes, I did check it. She has lightweight. Okay. The town of Rask, where Storch and his companions call home, is no different. But this sleepy hamlet would suit change. 101 food. Yeah, this, this hack is food 101. When was the last time you went home? Been a while now, probably as long as you. I need some drink, one second. If they can talk about food 24 seven, I can talk about drinking. Drinking is good. Been a while now, probably as long as you. Yeah, it's been over a month since I handed my parents my share of the money from the merchants. That was quite a haul. Wait, it's almost a month now, damn. Time skip confirmed. Mecha drank water, add to the food counter. Water isn't food. <laughs> water is just the substitute for food. That was quite a haul. Our family should be able to pay taxes for a few months at least. Taxes? I hope you're right. I just want to be able to rest easy. Go back to how things were. Storch, you haven't been yourself lately. Is something wrong? <laughs> yeah, post time skip designs. I guess I'm a little homesick is all. I worry about Marlon. You shouldn't worry so much about your younger brother. He's more capable than you think. He's certainly better on horseback than you are. Hey, you know that I feel funny riding on an animal. Are animals food? No, they're not, because I don't eat meat. It never felt right to me. I like keeping my feet firmly planted on the ground. No need to stray far. You and I both know everything he knows about sword fighting he learned from me. <laughs> ha, I'm teasing <laughs> I'm ease up. I'm sure Marlon is fine. <laughs> Storch, Vagilus, enemies are attacking. Lara, is everything okay? He looked like he's been running for a while. It's your hometown, Storch. It's under attack by bandits. What? Marlon, you mean the tax people are here? Marlon's holding out with your parents and a few of the villagers, but we gotta go back and save him. Right, Vagilus, let's move. Lara, alert the others. You can count on me. Right, let's go. Marlon, you and your brother should hide in the basement. There's plenty of food there. You'll be safe there. Dad, what about you? I'll stay up here and keep an eye out. Don't worry about me, Marlon. But Dad! Your leg still hasn't healed. Let me guard the house. No, Marlon, it's too dangerous. You taught me how to ride horses, and Storch taught me how to use a sword. And this blade, it's Augustine's. I can protect us if anyone comes near, but you're not in any shape to. Please, Dad. They're around to find Storch. They're gonna save us. I just know it! I can hold out in the meantime, but you just gotta trust me. Dad! He makes a good point, dear. You shouldn't overexert yourself. Hard to argue with a woman. All right, you win, Marlinus. I'll be, Marlin. I'll be down in the basement. Be careful, you hear, Marlinus. Right, I'll do my best. Storch, Lara, I hope you both come back soon. Father did a good job of like imitating Fire Emblem's speech, I gotta say. All right. So another town, we got a... Larissa. What is this? Whose dad is this? Daughter of a famed blacksmith. Okay, so the dad, the dad is her blacksmith. She doesn't let you forget it. Ironlands. And is this the, the blood one? Strong repose. When I attack damage, plus three. I like that skill a lot. It's really useful. Uh, it doesn't. It's not added in her menu right now. Okay, so I don't have to. I have to think about it. And I see a bunch of people around her trying to attack here. Uh, we got Marlin here. Is he moving? He can. He probably won't though. Uh, brother's sword. Marlon's personal sword, brave, plus two defense res. A brave sword, but four might, okay, that makes sense. And Kanto reposition, swap, okay, swap. And Kanto. Swap is kind of cringe, but on the cavalry unit, it can kind of work, I guess. I was not too busy. Dude, I thought it was, it was a, oh, Gherkin is here. Gherkin moment. Damn, gaming. People like Larissa, all right. There it is. 
Okay, so Gherkin, usual stuff, an axe mercenary. What do you got? Dance? Oh, Intimidate. Intimidate? Yo, I really need to hit up Weedle Tweedle for some kind of collab, because every time I come into their into their stream, they're like, oh my god, Mecha, the best Fire Emblem player. I'm like, oh, you're so sweet. You're so nice. Armonite's with five move, shut up and take my money. I know, right? Armonite's good. I read about the five move Armonite, it's really nice. Okay, so... This looks super difficult. I assume I have to get to... I probably have to split up to get them quickly enough. But they're both fine-ish from the start. I need to do something for my management, probably. I probably need to get an Iron Sword on somebody. Uh, Bungalow. Go on you. Uh, anyone in particular need the thing? Who needs the pure water? Nobody, right? It's kind of sad, sad, but it's only one mage, so I don't think I need to pure water for anyone in particular. But I do want to give you something that's like not this. I'm gonna give you a phone and get another iron sword. I know I don't have to like hold back my pure personal swords and stuff, but it's nice to have an option that's not that, you know? Yeah, I kind of wish I had like a bulk unit, but you know what? We're gonna lose, lose that this turn probably. Can recruit by storage, so we should be okay there. Okay, I want to play. But I gotta refill my water. So now we'll start. Let's see, let's hear the map music. This looks awful. Is this our punishment? Focus, Torch. Marlon, your parents are here still. Looks like some of the villagers have taken up arms, and I'm sure Marlon is fighting with them. You're right, we have to persevere. I'm not gonna have, let, that, let anyone harm my family. Storch, don't just rush into battle. Shh, there's no reasoning with him, with him when it comes to this. Finally got the his armor on. Time to go help the village. If you take the shop, that will be ruined. Can't imagine a girl like me not having money at all. Yeah, don't don't take the armory. That's cringe. Alright. Beerby. Refilling the water supply. Food. Drink acquired. Alright, don't just rush into battle, bro. Just rush into battle. Uh, I put Axe Guy really far back, so he can't attack the soldier. Big mistake. Looks like we're gonna have to make up for it in some way. But there's no one up here, so like we're probably fine. We'll probably have to get to Larissa soon, because he's like under the most attack. Do rush into battle? Yeah, I will rush into this battle. At first. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I can shove. Well, I can't shove him closer, unfortunately. Shucks. This won't lead to the, uh... I guess this is just a link range. We can just do this, though. It's pretty good. And, like, kill with her. Yeah, that works. Honestly, that works just fine. We should do it. We should do it. My, my positioning is completely awful, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, I don't read everything in chat, so if you try to spoil me... You've been fooled. Dun, 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 dun. I mean, when I say don't hoard, what I mean is like, oh, I can kill this enemy with my personal weapon and get a like, really huge threat out of my way, but I want to save it. That's not the kind of hoarding you should do. Also, I should have talked there. Hold up. Can I still change that? No, I can't. Okay. We'll just do it another turn then. That music feels off. I see what you mean, but I don't mind it personally right now. Let's see. We can kill with the Pegasus Knights, so... Oh, you got. Oh, you can shove storage like five times, yeah. I mean, the thing about shove chains is that they really hamper your movement for the next couple turns, so yeah, not my favorite kind of move to do either. Like, in this case, you can argue you should use the Lady Sword because, you know, you avoid the counter. Put the Burger King and Baraku Emblem. I do agree, I need to play both, but I only have so much time in life. I do want to stream Round Hacks more often, though, because they're really. I've been thinking about it a lot, and like, sure, they're probably worse for views short term because hacks just aren't well as well known. But there's not infinite environment content out there anyway, so what's the point? I think you could use some reinforcements. In fact, what's probably gonna happen is this bow user is gonna go here and attack, which means I probably want him to be able to attack from the other side. So we're gonna go here. So they've come back. 
Looks like this was the right town. Damn it, Cutter. This town is bone dry. Only here for your sake. I'll show him. The great Gherkin will get revenge. Yeah, so you're like, yeah, I want content, because there's not going to be infinite content out there. Alright, let's see Larissa in action. So I might as well play some fun ROM hacks to have something new to try. No, I don't think Ready Dawn is the... Yeah, no, nah, I don't know if it's the least hated game in, the, in RFE. I know it's not the most hated game. I think, uh... Generally, Telius is just a safe bet for liked games. Just in general. Uh, this Merc will be a little bit tough to kill. Not that tough at all. Actually, because if I didn't do the shove, I probably couldn't have done it. Yeah, the, the shove is getting in my way, but I can still longbow. If this hits, will be good. Uh, nice one, uh, Fatalist. Nice one. Very cool. I appreciate the accuracy here. Yeah, now it's kind of annoying. We don't have to get the Larissa right now, to, to be honest. It'd be, it'd be nice, though. Would've been super cool to just recruit the person I wanted to recruit right now, but we can't all be this good. Well, I guess I'm just gonna kill this Merc, then. I'm done making Fire videos, I know, right? Arcadey personal moment. Uh, oh yeah, that would be good too. You're right. I keep forgetting it's there. It's so weird to have a Reaver ranged weapon. It's so strange. I can't wrap my head around it. But I think this guy gets one round if he attacks uh, uh, my guy. Maybe not. He does not. I don't know what Arcade is doing. I just know this, this guy can probably be handled without the personal sword. We'll see. No, I'll see. I do need someone to stand here, though. Or here. To block the spot. It's gonna be my Pegasusy. Oh, I have to talk combo here. I might as well do this one, then. Let's do it. S-Fear. Fageless. It's not like you to initiate... ...a conversation. Are you okay? Did a brigand knock you in the head? I'm fine. It is Torch I am worried about. Yes, he does seem a bit distant lately. He yearns for the peaceful times of yore, he tells me. His lifestyle is wearing him out. I've gleaned the same thing. If we don't do this, though, we're all going to get thrown in jail. And it's not like we have the numbers or skills to challenge Lord Graydon to make him lower the tax rates. We're going to have to do this for a while, unless we can find a way to leave Baldaro. I don't disagree. This is why I worry about him. He hasn't accepted reality yet. Sometimes, Vagilis, people never accept reality. People will spend their whole lives trying to recreate the fleeting feeling that they had in their youth, looking backwards instead of forwards toward that what they could next. What they could do next. Indeed. Let us hope that Storch can adopt this mentality. You're a good friend, Vagilis. Storch needs you now more than ever. And you. Ever since you and Lara arrived, he has wanted to ensure your safety too. His family helped us quite a bit when we came here. I owe it to him. Let's pay back the favor. Let's go. Right. How about some support level increase with that? Alright, you know what? Pegasus lady. Let's help out over here. Here you go. Ether not. Ether honestly was an idiot. Did you not, did you not see his goodbye video? He is completely deranged. <laughs> I will not miss him. Sorry, I just don't. Um, well, I could get to talk this con this turn, but then rip. So I guess just five next to here. Like I don't know what are, what else what are urgent things are gonna happen. Uh, I'm just gonna go here for now. Make a mid level move. And get ready to talk or something. I don't know. Go to talk to Marlin. Well, I think. Oh, actually, she can talk to Marlin. Let's do that then. I thought it was only um, my other man who could do that. Here you go. Here you go. It's not on the Mang's case, but it's someone who supported Mang's. That's why I won't miss him. Uh, 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 uh. I'm not going to get into it any further here, but just know he was weird. Oh, a uh, couple things for last level ups. I see, I see, I see. Gaming. Alright, okay. Probably not great. I wasn't doubling him with the other guy anyway, so it's fine. Here you go. Favorite prog rock band? I mean, I've always been fond of Pink Floyd, but it's not the one I listen to the most anymore. Uh, I listen to a lot of uh, Maybe She Will. Honestly, Prog Rock is just a really good genre. Also, you were supposed to defend the armory, not run away from it. Okay, so we can talk with 
them both. I'm just gonna do this part then though. Actually, we can do this. This will close off the whole armory part. But this is good. Goodbye. And I see a guy came from the side. That's kind of... We should do something about. We can use the thief there. I do want to grab Larissa this turn. I'm probably going to go up one Vuln. And talk with you next. Can you like take care of this by yourself? No, right? No way. Uh, you can go through the wall. Attack from here. So many options here. None of them really bad. I think... This is an option. All these options. All these options. We could be proactive here, but it's like... There's so many options, so many options. I think we'll go with this. Any other hacks in mind besides Vision Quest? Well, Souls of the Forest is what someone wanted. I know it's not released yet though. I know it's still being tweaked. I'd rather play it when it's complete, like 100%. So that's something I'm keeping in mind. I don't know if I should be baiting more trouble in already or not. Let's just make sure we do this properly first. So this guy needs to like get hit, first of all. I need to recruit the other one. Yeah, apparently we're using Lyra. I don't know. I'm still just like going through the motions here. I haven't I don't pay very much when I'm concentrating on like doing the map properly, it's really hard to evaluate the level ups, you know? <laughs> Storage. So it takes an attack on our town for you to show your face. Hi, Larissa. Hell, all you have to say, we haven't spoken in months. Every time I come in looking for you, your brother says you aren't around. Martin isn't lying. Look, just be careful, okay? This is a battlefield. Don't worry about me. I'll be fine. Will he ever grow up? Probably not. Uh, shove Larissa up? I guess. Oh, I wanted to fall, actually, so I shouldn't have done that. It's fine. Um... Let's see, how bad is it to just attack and then run away? Oh, she one rounds. Okay, that guy's just gonna stand in the forest before I run up. I'm gonna go here, I think. Oh, you have to talk with her too for next turn. That's good. I'm going to bait this one breaking over here. There's no bow BS here, right? No bow BS, no houses. Actually, there's a house here. I would like to visit that, but I don't think the Pegasus Knight is the right choice for it. What if we get this house right now? I mean, that's, I know that's where he's, his friends are. Uh, oh, we can use Larissa to talk to him. Let's do that. Useless shove. Larissa, why are you out all alone? Are you okay? Of course I'm okay. I'm the daughter of a flame blacksmith, only has the finest equipment. These bandits don't stand a chance. Why are you using Iron Lance then? I'm damn near impenetrable with this armor my father got for me. Huh, I think I've heard my brother say that about you too. What was that? Uh, nothing. I'm gonna go back and fight over here now. Just don't do anything stupid, okay? Holy heck, was it something I said? Okay, now we have Marlin, brother of the Storch, yeah. 77777. Seven, 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 seven. I'm disappointed he doesn't have any stats with 6, but you know what? Fine. Um, growths. Uh, supposed to be kind of tanky, I think. Kind of tanky. Kind of low in vibes right now. I wanna, He probably has a combo with his parents when he visits his house, right? There's no way he doesn't. Let's, let's try him out. Let's go here. Oh heck, how could I forget this? But if I get scraped up, this will heal me up in a jiffy. When I get back out there and beat up those bandits. Elixir. How oh, very nice. And then I guess we'll take this forest. Here's a personal sword. That I don't really want him to use a lot, so... I like, I want to use it, but not against two bandits. That was 50 uses, though, so maybe I'm worried about nothing, but... This is, actually, he can use this, can't he? No, he can't. It's, it's, apparently, dudes can and I cannot use this. So apparently, this dude cannot use it. Maybe it's because of D-Rank? I don't know. Let's see. Let's find out. Oh, did I put him in range? No, I didn't put him in range of the Archer. We're good. We're good. We're good. A negative growth mod going. This is the Blacksmith, Larissa. Oh, I'll go back for it then. E-Swords Gaming. The future is here, guys. The future is here. Everyone go talk to the future. Yeah, I missed the sex bots. Oh no, they took the armory. Larissa, if only you were here to stop this. Larissa, please. Mm, 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 mm. Nice level. Oh, they just keep on coming. They just won't stop. Easy pickings, though. Okay, I'd love to stay around and like fight these dudes, but you know, you gotta go to the armory. You gotta go defeat bosses over here. 
think he's gonna do that in the end. I'm gonna vault with him, so let's try this, see if it works out. Yeah, the bandit was like, oh, I'm Marty, I'm gonna buy something from the armory. It's gonna happen, trust me. Here you go. Nice level up. Kinda nice, kinda nice. I see a mage on the radar that I think I can get to attack me at an inconvenient spot. It's a pretty easy map so far, honestly. Pretty nice. Okay, let's go here. And finally, I can fall with him. I'm gonna do that anyway before he gets to the boss. And this guy, I was just gonna die to the thief. We're gonna run you down to the blacksmith. Maybe I will have the Pegasus not get the house. Maybe I won't. I'm kind of liking the Pegasus tonight, to be honest. But maybe it's just the Lady Blade that's doing it for me. Uh, how much does this do? Nice, cool. Okay, you know what? Take this guy out. Dude, you won round these. Nearly won a kill. It's so gaming. Oh, uh, they can't team up with the Iron Sword. I only got one. First world problems. I can't port my weapons. Alright, go take him out. Hey, now, Atsuko got plus HP earlier. Like, that's it. That's all she got. I'm not lucky. I refuse to, to believe that. Okay, we'll, we'll take this one, I guess. Let's check out the Vendor. Fire, Thunder... I mean, Thunder's nice to have, I guess. Have it yet? Oh, calm down, calm down. 8 Might is pretty good. I don't need to buy an Elixir or anything like that. Phones I can buy in preps. Yeah, but this is all good. Uh, apparently I can't kettle back into the bush, so... Tank energy? Go, go, Marlin. Don't die. Uh, you did your recruitments. You can do your talk now. If you want. I'll just go here. Do this talk. This is where you ran off to. I'm not mad, I just don't appreciate your lying. You said you were going to town to get food for dinner later. I don't make the rules. It's food. If you want to spend time with your boyfriend, you don't have to hide it from me. We can talk about this, woman to woman. Marlon is not my boyfriend. Oh, my apologies. Maybe if my daughter told me where she was going, I wouldn't have to draw my own conclusions. Alright, alright. I'm sorry for lying. I did pick up food. <laughs> Marlon helped me with the vegetables since he knows how to pick out the good ones, being a farmer and all. It's okay. Please don't feel like you need to hide from me, Laura. Lyra. If you aren't truthful with me, I can't protect you. And if anything were to happen to you, I know. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I won't do it again. Thank you, love. When the battle is over, be sure to talk more about your boyfriend. I'd love to hear about him. He's not- Ah, oh, Moms are so annoying! Such a relatable video game, am I right, guys? I hate it when my mom thinks I have a boyfriend or a girlfriend. It's the worst. Yup! Easy. Not gonna lie, it is pretty cringe. Or you just hang out with someone and your parents are like, Is that your boyfriend? Is that your girlfriend? Food again. I don't count it when it's the same conversation, when they're literally mentioning it twice. That would be like counting the ale that they talked about twice. That'd be kind of... That's, that's cheating. We don't need to force extra food. The game will deliver the food to us. Having friends in general is not cringe, though. And... 7 damage. Take that. I wonder what this map is like in hard mode. Probably just like, yo, that kind of stuff can mess you up. Yeah, okay, that's... I see where this is going. Okay, well, we have a tanky character now, but unfortunately she can't get anywhere. We can pick her up, maybe. Uh, she needs to get to Blacksmith, right? So let's get that done. Honestly, these are not super threatening right now. I think it's Arcade's turn to heal, so how about we just pick this up one up with Storch, that... Uh... <laughs> whatever his name is. Badge of Seal can make his way to the bottom village. Is there a ROM hack with a main character as an archer? Probably. It probably exists. Actually, this guy's a reaver weapon. He could probably help out at the bottom with the Kaizuru. There you go. And go to the blacksmith. Oh. No combo? What is this? Yes, Badge of Seal. I did, I did that one. What the hell is this? Slach's Bard. Powerful sword. A six plus five speed. Well, glad I can buy that here. Um, I don't really want any of this. Although the slim slants could be kind of cool, I guess. Why is it a Dutch weapon? That's funny. 
I'll, I'll buy this because it costs 420. Didn't get the money for it, SMH. Yeah, I, I didn't sell all my weapons. <laughs> it's time to sell the S-rank bow. <laughs> time to get some money. Uh, you know what? Lowen, not Lowen has got this. I'll use the brother sword just to like have used it once to say I used it. And then we'll like Kanto, fly left, etc. Trade. You know, you know how it works. So everything gets six boots. Oh yeah, there's a there's an establish shop in this game. Gaming. Yeah, this this will get the job done. That's rank sort of unusable even if you buy it. Why is it there then? Is it like a, a Pokemon bicycle? Come on, that's strange. I don't know where most help is going to be needed, so I'm just going to move my characters. The joys of playing blind. <laughs> There's a girl calf with a stepbrother perf sword. <laughs> oh god. It's a scam. It's a slowpoke tail. Hacking the money. It's a, it's a good flavor, I like it. Okay. Uh, you are probably gonna get two shot very easily, and then this guy you can like Kayaku! Take that. I think Elagor's spear is supposed to be kind of good, so I guess you can always play that one. I don't want this archer to go in the house, but kind of, you know, lock myself in, so this will be how it be. Dude, seriously? That's an annoying miss. Uh, hopefully he'll go for my guy here. Do we take 9 from him? No, in that case we're completely safe doing this. Let's go. I start st selling snake oil as 10k elixir. Even gods miss sometimes. Okay, alright, balanced. Set in like 3 different stats, you know how it is. It's okay guys, the, th the thief is here, thief mom is here. Uh, I kind of don't want to occupy the back line for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, let's take a kill with each of these characters. Or we can get the house. You know what? Get the house. I need to get that eventually. So you came back to fight the bandits? I cannot fight, but perhaps you can use this javelin. A wise sage gave it to me and left it near this cryptic, cryptic note. One or two ranged weapons are the best for defeating enemies quickly. I don't really get it, but maybe you will. Good luck and thanks. Ah. Feeding enemies quickly, my specialty. Let's go in the forest and watch these guys suicide. Actually, let's not. Let's go here. Give her our iron sword back. And sit back and watch the carnage as we hide here. Let's feed our Pegasus. Pegasusy. Something right here. Here you go. I like feeding Pegasi when I have the choice. Took us personal skill. Oh yeah, she needs less weapons. True. <laughs> they found Don Don, yeah. He knows. Yeah, this is... Skills like this one are the reason why I personally don't like skills too much. It's easy to forget about them. And like, sure, it's rewarding when you don't forget. And it adds the strategic depth, but... I don't think Final needs more depth to be interesting, personally. Just stats alone and weapons alone can grant you that. So I don't think you need skills in your game, but the way that Panon's implemented them, I think is fine. It's not my personal preference. Dana is always canon. Okay. So maybe we can hit this guy. Okay. Uh, let's bump this guy on the head. Trap him in the village. Oh, we doubled him. Nice steel bow. I'm back on skills. Understandable. He's Demoiselle, right? Gentleome, yeah, whatever. Th that thing. You probably remember that one too. It's probably kind of important. What's he got again? I'm just reminding myself of the skills now because it's been a while since I checked him last. Right, let's go here, get the house. What are you doing here? Bandits are not welcome. Wait, you're not bandits? What, you're here to rescue me? I'm old and confused. Please just leave me be. Check this, it may be helpful. Armor's lair. Defeat boss time. Oh, look, we got this. Nine damage. Uh, so you can get three speed? 
plus 3, so she will have 13. Suddenly we double. Interesting. Unfortunately, we're all full on items, so... I have to take a bit of a detour to do that. We have a hand axe, right? He does. Okay, we can make it happen. If we really want to, we can attack her with plus 3 speed. I don't think I really want to that badly. We can get her there with the speed required and probably just get hand axe in the face. Maybe shove? No. I think there's a way to have her have like less than three weapons. Oh wait, just one item is enough, right? Okay, actually, is it is it three or less than three? Three or less. Okay, never mind. Let's just take one item. Never mind. I thought I needed two. That's why I was confused. Okay, so I'll take the thunder off of her. And then we'll see how much we can do. We can always shove and like get him, yeah. We can shove our big guy. Let's see how much that does. Is there any talk combos left? I think I might have no I think I'm done with him. Let's see. There you go. Okay, we can deal like 70 damage even. It's pretty poggers. We do have to hit all of them though. If we miss. We're kind of uh, up the shit creek. Let's try it. I think we're probably fine. So the hero is here. We're gonna make you fear the name of the Dragon Blood Bandits. Dragon Blood Bandits? Jeez, only one thing worse than your deeds is your choice in names. A cheeky 1A, we'll see how you like this. We'll fillet you and your family. That's food. You don't write these kind of things and don't intend for it to mean food. That's food. Fillet is food. No one messes with my family. Mm. Got him. Okay, now I know he has Intimidate, but that's just like hidden a void, right? That's not anything special, right? All enemies within two tiles? Well... You're not gonna be within two tiles of me after I kill you. Shake in your boots! Quiver in fear! This town is as good as ours, and you are a damned fool to stand in our way now. Steel Axe. You'll regret this, I swear. Yeah, we have 84 hit on a dating, dating matching website. I can't believe it either. Alright. Strength good. Storch, you're a complete menace. You're like a crazed beast on the battlefield. I ain't never seen the sight of you before. It was... something. Where's Marlon? Relax, the kid's alright. Saw him, he handled himself pretty well out there. Brother, Marlon, where are her parents? They're safe, brother. I told you, they're hiding in the basement. Trust me, just go look. There's food there. I see. Thank you, Marlon. I'm glad you're safe. Aw, oh, heck, brother. I just did what you would do is all. Marlon, let's go see mom and dad. Hey, Vagilus. You know old Storch better than me. He's always so like this. It's like he's here, but he's only focusing on one thing and tuning out of all the other things, you know? I hear you, cousin. He's been like this since the old, his older brother. His older brother? Vagisil, you slippery toad. Nobody ever told me Storch had an older brother. I think Storch tries to forget too. His older bro. Arcady, it is nice to see you again. Vagisil. Larissa. Larissa, you're looking all fine in that armor of yours. Tell me, who taught you to wield a lance like that? You're one heck of a force. Stow it, boy. Where's Storch? His house. He's not interested. Way to cut right to the chase, cousin. Yo! Oh, it's not that, Fagilus. I mean, a woman of my stature and wealth would not be so foolish as to associate with such an uncouth vagabond. Keep telling yourself that. You. Whoa, now. I'm about to M-O-V-E out of this conversation. I thought battles got heated, but who boy, Fagisil, you sure know how to dial it up. Yes, I did see the funny blacksmith. Thank you. Maybe you should take a breather, too. Let's go, cousin. Right. Lovely seeing you again, Larissa. Get home safe now, you hear? He's as antagonistic as ever. I suppose I can't blame him. He was always a loyal friend to Storch. Alas, Larissa, why do you find yourself caught in this struggle? We're back! And look, Storch came home. Mom, Dad, you're both alright? My sons. Oh, I'm so glad you're both safe. Storch, we're fine. How's the damage outside? We tried to keep it to a minimum. I don't think they'll be coming back anytime soon. Storch swooped in right in the nick of time, Dad, like a real hero. Right. Marlon, take your mom upstairs. We should be off to sleep soon. Yes, Dad. Storch, thank you. Have a good rest. Please feel free to stay tonight. Good night, Mom. 
Let's take a moment to appreciate Mechamate's torch of his axe when they wanted to met for this time of months. <laughs> totally unnecessarily too, like it was literally just for for bad blood. I know where the hell you've been off to, or where this money is coming from, but it seems like too strange of a coincidence that bandits would come to our neck of the woods the same time you decide to show up. Nothing to say, it's as they say. What goes around comes around. You better shape up, boy. Your mother damn near had a heart attack waiting for Marlon to come home. It's hard enough to scrape by on the money we have with these oppressive taxes, and if you're responsible for bringing bandits to our front door to take the leftovers... It's not like that, Dad. I've been working up at the port. As a mercenary, guarding merchants, that sort of thing. Don't try to pull the wool over my eyes, boy. I see through this. Ain't nobody would be big enough fool to hire a sniveling coward like you. You best get out of here before the sun rises and more trouble comes through. You better stop coming around to drop off coin too. Not gonna take it anymore now that I've confirmed where it's coming from. <laughs> you best take it back. I could just place too much happy ten. He thought having shoving would help their relationship. That throws our food. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, Storch didn't band it this time. He was going to band it and get the money that way, but he didn't do it in the end. But he was going to. And he, he did band it the day before, so... He's not completely wrong. Last thing we need is more death in his family. Dad! I've said what I wanted to say. Don't come back here, Storch. It's for your own good. You're going down a path I cannot condone. There's no joy in surviving It's through if it's through unjust means. Maybe one day you'll see that. Alright, I see how it is, Dad. I only wish you could see from my perspective. I only wanted to help. If that makes me too much of a burden, then so be it. Farewell, Father. Tell Mom I'm sorry. Get gold! Did we rob the bandits? Are we going to stick around for a few days, Storch? No, we leave tonight. Alright, I'll inform the others. I remember the merchant saying he came from Port Irene. I'm sure we'll hear some rumors and figure out a plan north from there. Brother. Marlon, what are you doing out here? I should ask you the same question. Why aren't you back home? Not welcome there anymore. But why? Dad says so, and it's his house and all, so I gotta be off. And everyone else is going with you too? Fagisil, Lara, Esphere, all of them? That's right. Let me join you, brother. No, brother. We're knee-deep in some dangerous stuff. Marlon, you wouldn't want to get involved. If anything were to happen to you... You saw how I fought back there. I'm better on horseback than you. I'm ready for this. Honest. No, Mara, it's too dangerous. You need to stay here with Mom and Dad. Dad is not in the same shape as he was, and Mom can use the help too. <laughs> don't cry, Marlon. You're too old to cry. I just... I just don't want to lose you. I... <laughs> Dad's changed Storch. It's real depressing and all to be home. He's always muttering about you and Augustine. You gotta let me come with you. Augustine. Alright, I suppose it's easier to protect you if you're close by. This is not the easy street, Marlon. I hope you're ready for what's to come. You mean it, B brother? I may regret this, but you need to be strong, all right? Strong for me, mom, even dad. I spent so much time worrying about you. I guess it'll be easier for me if I know you're right next to me, right? I'll do my best to protect you, but don't be reliant on me. You gotta be able to fend for yourself, you hear me? I won't let you down, brother. I'm coming too. Marissa? Look, Storge, I know that you and I aren't on the best terms, but I want to help. I care as much about this town as you do. The shop isn't doing as well as it once did. If you're heading north to find work, count me in. Even though we're fine financially, we're on the best smithy in town, extra gold couldn't hurt. Alright, thank you Larissa. It's dangerous business we're in. Be ready for the worst. Don't say I didn't warn you. Fighting every day, heck, exhausting. Ain't even able ain't even able to articulate how it feels. I ain't even able to articulate this line. But if it's what we gotta do to survive these taxes, then it's worth fighting for. I think what so far, the impression I'm getting for Pandan is that he's only got one way to phrase the taxes, and that's through saying taxes. I think using some different words for it might be worth thinking about. With all of us together, we'll be fine. Let's hope this is the, that's the case this time. Meanwhile, in Castle Bolaro, where the evil people are... Lord Titus, I understand that you are grieving at this moment. Your father's death was an unfortunate accident. <laughs> But please, think clearly for a moment about this suggestion. The taxes must remain high, so we can focus on important projects. Strategic initiatives that will drive Bolaro forward. What's in the martyr for taxes? Ah, no, I don't speak English. How about you ask Chet? While my father's death has wrought havoc on my mind, I have not allowed my grief to clot my judgment. 
Lord Gradin, my dear uncle, I implore you to reconsider. My father, Lord Vespasian, and I shared similar views on this. Why do we charge these high taxes and jail the people? What are these initiatives? As a noble of Bellaro, I would like to contribute to the success of my empire. I would ask you, I would ask you consider my request as an advisor to you. Now, Lord Titus, all will be made clear soon. Infrastructure projects, trade relations, the ability to import and export with greater velocity. The economic situation will only improve with a strong, well-funded governing body, which I will lead, of course. But what if the poor who cannot pay, if they are in jail, will they be able to enjoy this? Lord Titus, you mustn't. General Leslie, please do not speak out of turn. This is no negotiation. Titus, my decision is final. You may see yourself as an advisor to me. I will remind you that my power is absolute to me. Alright, Lord Gradin, I will respect your wishes. Good. Now then, we must turn to the current state of affairs. General Leslie has been patrolling the southern part of Bolaro. He has noted an increase in crime. But she wasn't able to apprehend them? Cringe! <laughs> Fire her! Make her pay taxes! No, she did not. But she will. We will deploy additional soldiers to eliminate crime. It is our job as rulers to ensure a functioning, safe society, no? Yes, of course, but what's this criminal activity? General Leslie, what intelligence can you share on this band? They are a ragtag group. Only a handful of men and women in their ranks, but they are a slippery lot. They dispatched a town guard and raided homes in the area, stealing valuables and gold. I suspect they will head further north, where towns people are wealthier, and commerce far more frequent. I will personally lead a sweep of all ports. I will personally drink some water. I see. This is most troubling. Thank you, General Leslie. This disturbance will be resolved quickly. General Leslie is as fierce as they come. They stand little chance. Excuse me, for I must leave to make preparations. Emperor Feston himself will be visiting in the coming weeks. Farewell, my nephew. A pleasure as always, Lord Titus. Helga. Da da da. Thank you, Lord Uncle. May your preparations be made swiftly and fruitfully. Fruit is... is, is fruit... food? <laughs> well, sister, I must commend your restraint. Are you well? Captain Zoya, my dear sister, I apologize for being late. As you know, things have gotten a bit out of hand. The tax collection is rather aggressive, and crime is on the rise. I fear the two are linked. No, no fruit? Okay. Look at her neck. She doesn't have a neck. Or you mean the left one. But she has a turtleneck. <laughs> Kinda funny. Does Lord Gradin share this with you, sister? You speak as if you share Lord Titus's views on the matter. A soldier must reflect the strength of their leader. He must also stand as one. If Gradin wills it, I will see it through. Between you and I, as sisters, I disagree with the approach. However, I cannot allow my emotions to obstruct my duty. Being fierce on the field of battle, striking fear into enemies, I always try to remember that I am here because of Lord Granin's kindness. You and I both owe him for this chance, and I must act this way when fighting. It is essential for victory and for the success of Bolaro. I understand, sister. I will not trouble you. But enough talk of this. I will depart on the morrow. Sister, would you care to join me for a fine wine? I would hope to have a restful evening before traveling. Is that a Bolaran red? My dear sister, you know me well. That is food. Drinks are food, especially wine. I'd be delighted to join you, as my face reflects. You will also like the cheese that I found on the market. It is a rare Banchego cheese, aged for close to two years. The vendor says it is firm, with a compact consistency and a buttery texture. It sounds delightful, and more importantly, with this excellent with this dry red. Okay, that's another, that's another point of food. That has to be two points of food right there. That's two foods. Manchego and red wine. You have impeccable taste, Dusty. To be honest, Manchego is really delicious. It'd be great to spend the evening with you, not as colleagues, but as family. Say cheese. Say the line, Bart. Zoya, my dear sister, I am lucky to have you. And I you, Leslie. Shall we? Yes, let's go. Port Irene. Arguably, probably, last chapter for tonight. Taxes, taxes, taxes everywhere. Later, Atath. Oh. I need to stretch, refill, and grab food. Well, I mean drink, I mean water. I mean, we are back.
Okay, here we are. Port Irene is the center of commerce in the state of Bolaro. Oh. Less than a day's ride from Lord Gradin's manse, this port serves as the primary hub for importing and exporting food at the sea. Goods, not foods. Balaron trade seldom extends further than its own borders, as ships bounce from port to port along the eastern coast of the continent. Shopping districts and alleys are lined with bright colors of fruit and the warm energy of cheerful la laughter of those enjoying the salty sea breeze. Eh, there was some food in that line. They said salt. But mostly fruit. However, as gold eludes the pockets of the citizenry, merchants are now few and far between. Now, Port Irene's once bustling streets and colorful alleys are now but a playground for pirates. Ah yes, the port chapter. Gotta have a Fire Emblem port chapter. Port Irene, I feel like it's been a heck of a long time since we were here. We used to come here when we were little to browse all the shops. I need some of the important fruit from Mahala. Yo, that's more fruit. It's the same, it's basically the same fruit. We'll, we'll count it as one. Brings back a lot of memories of my brothers and I. Yeah, when my mom and I, when my mom and I came out here from Balti, we spent a few months here while she worked and I studied. I love the smell of the ocean breeze. Makes you feel at ease, doesn't it? Mm-hmm, I always liked it here. Me too. Hello, are you just arriving? Yes, we're just arriving to port. Can we help you? This town is unsafe. A group of pirates is disembarked. I suggest you leave before you don't have a choice. Pirates? Why are they here? This isn't good. They'll tear this place apart. Mom, we have to do something. We can't let them destroy the port. You're right, sir. Please allow us to deal with the pirates. Oh, are you mercenaries? Something like that. Let me go inform our leader that we're in for another fight. Thank you. Oh, God, has blessed those kind travelers. I am Onism. A simple priest. I do not fight, but please allow me to heal your wounded. Let's go, healer! You sure, mister? I don't want you to get hurt. As long as I follow in the light, I cannot be harmed. I do not fear death, only the judgment that comes therein. Oh, okay then. Let's get ready. Let's go. Let's get one Onism. And he's forced. And he has a warp staff! Let's go! Uh, magic divided by three. Oh, that's not a whole lot, is it? I mean, it's probably got a minimum range of 5, right? So that'll be useful. 15 uses a lot. I'll definitely use this when I feel like I want to. Spur res, okay. And growths. I feel like everyone has these growths in, in some shape or form. They all have like the same growth total. It just gets like moved around a little bit. Pretty epic. What is this description? A priest from Navan, formerly a pirate, seeking atonement. Ah, uh, yes. One of those types, huh? Okay, oh, we're all starting behind this thing here. Okay, let's see how this is gonna work. Y'all are immobile, that's good. Y'all pirates, y'all pirates. <laughs> Dole Hamra, thanks for the five for your personal food counter. I hope my thing works. I think it pops up every now and then. Nice! Nice, there we go. It goes right off my food counter. Thank you for my personal food counter buff. I appreciate it. I love having food around. I actually completed the void of food right now. What are we doing here? Pirates, just the normal ass pirates, right? No skillerinos. No skillerinos to worry about, just the usual stuffs. Yeah, just the usual pirates. I think I'm not gonna worry about these guys until I'm done dealing with these guys. I think this might be where good old uh, Arcadia with the Kinryu will come in handy. I haven't used it a whole lot yet, so I can probably afford to use it a couple times. I might even pure water, just put him here. I could even warp to get closer, but I feel like that's... I don't want to hoard a 15 used warp, obviously, but I feel like the first turn here is not the right place to use it. Uh, there's a soldier here. Actually, I don't have great means for the soldier. I guess uh, Larissa is probably pretty good here. Like, how much damage did you do to her? Like, three? Four? Damn. Cringe knight. Alternatively, we could deal with them some other way. Marlon can't use anything but yeah, I can't use anything but swords. Let's do some things. I wanna trade around that lance on him. His Javi can go on you. His Thunder can go on you. Oh, you can't even use it yet. Yo, cringe layer, cringe. Uh, armor's layer. That should go on storage probably. And finally, I think I could use a non- Personal sword on you, why not? And I want 
we're... I think we're actually kind of good here. Six bot food? Yes, definitely. Oh, I wanted to make sure that she activates her ability. Well, that's already the case, so that's all good. The early game units all have cringe weapon ranks. I agree, it's very cringe. I kind of... I think I'll just go in from here. I can kill this guy without needing Larissa or anything like that. I just use Larissa to wall everything off. How much do you reach? Not a whole lot. Okay, let's, let's, let's just go. This doesn't look super hard right now. We probably have to save the villages somehow. Let's see a vendor. Can we check what's in here? Building staffs, kind of nice. Armory. I mean, this is cells things I already have. A steel bow, I guess. Yay. Steel bow is kind of nice to have, probably, for a seal. Six bots food? Yes, they are. You can eat them. Reached on the ship for secret reasons. Oh, gaming? Okay, I will consider that. Alright, everyone. Looks like these pirates are up to no good. I don't want to get into another scrap, but I don't know what choice we have now. Drive out the pirates and protect the homes. So, the fine folks of Port Irene wish to put up a fight. Women and children, as Balaro becomes so weak. Yar har, this will be easy. Listen up, boys. This salty sea dog is going to take home a prize. Grab the women and children, kill the others. We'll be rich. You there, rogue fella. Mm, yes. Novala, what are you doing here? Go take your friends and hide below deck. I won't get your gold if you die out here in battle. I gotta bring you safe passage further down the coast, yeah? Hmm, that's right. It is most important that we arrive on time. You won't be long, right? Ain't no concern of you how long we take, eh? Just go wait below deck. We'll be done through soon, lad. Hmm, alright. Hmm, a chest. Poor Irene. Like a wench I slept with after too many ills. I look up on you with nothing but remorse and regret. This tower ain't got gold, not a gold to coin to spare. Women and children, oh Borst, you've gone too far. I should have left when Oms and fled those years ago. Hmm. Hmm. I know his music. Is it only Orson? Uh, where's Scotch? Well, I could talk to talk to Vagisil, okay. Interesting. Interesting maneuvers. Um, dun, 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 dun. Guess who's recruitable? I know, right? I do want to use Larissa. I feel like having a bulk of units is really nice for blind play. Uh, can anyone else cover here? Sort of. You're an Axe Knight, right? Yeah, I knew it. Okay, I'm just going to cover with uh, not low one. So you come in here, take the damage for free. Wrath Berserker, oh gaming. Here you go. Take that hit, and then we'll go in with uh, Brother. Alright, Step Sword, I'm stuck! Alright, he's gonna need to heal now. That's okay, we have a healer. I think he's in range too. I kinda wanna send him the other way, but it's fine. Woo, Puggers! Puggers. Alright. Nazar, apart from Freeung, rough yet well intended. And Wrath. Hmm, plus 20 crit on a 50%. That's a, that's a Wrath that makes me sad, honestly speaking. That is a Wrath that does not make me like a very happy pirate, personally. Why are you on the water? What are you doing? What do you think you're doing? I'm gonna go here so he can't take the forests. Just use the pure water. Take him on by myself. And, um... I'm not, I don't want to interfere with that, so I'm just going to chill here. I don't have a javelin handy. I can do this talk and canto out, I guess. Oh, I can't heal him now anymore. That's unfortunate. I, I was never able to begin with. I guess I'm going to sh like, shove. And then do it. If I rescue him out, but he's too thick, so I don't think he can do it. Hello, annoying kid. How's it going? Uh, let's just talk and hope that he lives. Tsuko, I gotta tell you, your Pegasus is uh, so pretty. It looks so magical and all went up the sky. How did you learn how did you learn to ride? Well, Pegasus aren't native to Makala. They come from Ouroboros, Ouroboro, <laughs> up north. You know geography well, Marlon? Not a lick of it. I never had much reason to leave to home till now. Well, Ouroboro is a country to the far northwest. It's where the Pegasi originate. After the Kingdom of Mahala was established, an envoy from the Church of Ouroboro gave us Pegasi. Horses don't do well in the sand, so having flying mounts helps. I learned to ride pretty young. Always loved it. Well, it sure is something. Flying seems real nice and all, but just don't go too far. We'd miss you if you just flew, got up and flew away. That's sweet of you, Marlon. Don't worry, I don't intend to. Gaming. Uh, can I check ranges? No, no, I cannot. So let's just chill here then. Longbow? Actual iron bow. 
actual iron bow. Oh, this guy dies turn one. He he has his own, he's just like that missed to blame. So no skin off my back. Uh, you actually support? Ooh. Well, I don't know how long she sticks around this this Jagan lady, but I gotta see the support. Oh, it's Lyra. Whatever. Let's do it. Lyra, what is it, Mother? You need to be more careful. Stay near me. You got that, Mother? How many times are we going to have this conversation? Pegasus. Let's see. The first time you died, and multiply the five copies. It's their personal skill. <laughs> How many times are we going to have this conversation? I'll be fine. I haven't died yet. How am I supposed to help if I'm tethered to your waist? Lyra, please. This isn't the negotiation. I'm asking you for you to... I get it. Oh, sorry, this whole fighting thing has got me stressed out. I understand, my dear daughter. A mother will always worry about her child. It cannot be helped. I'll try to be better. I promise. Thank you, Lyra. Yo, shoutouts for writing supports for ROM hacks. That takes forever. You stay here. You're not getting that. Just put her in such a way we can heal whoever... That should be good enough. Here goes. Mother. I can't say the word mother well. It's because of my accent. Mother. Mulder. That's why I always change it to mom. Because it sounds less awkward. Okay, he's gonna die now. Guarantee. Mm. Yeah, having that axe user will be nice. Oh, he doesn't. He has harbor bonuses. That's kind of cool. You're not dead yet. Not dead yet. I will reset for Marlon at this point. It's like turn one. I never said it was an Iron Man. What accent? I am Dutch. Haven't you? Can't you tell by my ridiculous accent? The misses, please. The other horse there would kill him. Dude, anything would kill this guy. Uh, yeah, he's dead. Oh my God. Accent, yes. Accent. Okay, it's time for a gambit, apparently. Yo, this is pretty cringe damage against the mage, not gonna lie. Oh, nice. Miracle dodge. I mean, he was only in this spot because he missed in the first place. So I consider that completely fair. Okay, so can you kill from here? Yeah, you can, of course. Uh, well, we definitely have the firepower to kill here. So this is, we don't have to worry about this part. Can we kill everything here? I think she can kill a full health pirate. Let's check that. Yes, you can. So we can like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, right? So we can do that. And it's all this stuff is a mage if we do that. Probably. And if Marlin can like not miss. Okay, that's like he can't mess that up. In fact, it's still oh this guy is kinda of strong. We need uh yeah, I don't have the caver slayer here. I don't think I have any way to kill this uh, axe knight in one round. Um priest guy can heal here. I can warp back, which is actually really funny. I could use my warp to bring him back up here. You know what? I need to move him there anyway to get to Nazam. So maybe I will do that. Uh, the question is how would it go? Because he only warped five tiles, right? So he goes like one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Is there force here? Uh, no. Wanna wear plot armor? If he does, he's definitely making it intense. Okay, here's the deal. We go here. Fire this guy. We can even shove more in one this direction so that he can go all the way here. Let me see if this will work, okay? So shove. And see how far he can actually warp before I actually do it. Okay, so he can go here and then go one, two, three, four, five. Who's gonna kill that archer though? Because I don't think anyone here is capable of killing that archer. It's like you don't double archers, right? Too slow. Too slow, Gandad. I guess they can combine for a kill on him. The archer does need to die if we want to do this whole move with her. If we don't do that, then there's no point. I guess he can combine for a kill with the bronze sword. Then he needs to be healed. Whatever, I'm gonna make this move. I think. Can just kill the archer with him, maybe? Instead of the X Knight. 10 strength, 10 speed. I think he could do it. He probably has to use his personal, but it's fine. Let's kill the archer with him then. Let's see if that works out. Heal Marlon. He'll heal himself, probably. That's probably what I'm gonna do. Kill the archer. Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to confirm the attack yet, but it works out just fine. Goodbye. There's probably a more optimal order, but I'm getting impatient. What are your skills again? 
Is it Charisma, right? Yeah, that's gonna help a little bit too. Okay, let me kill here. This. Magisil. And then... You don't kill this guy, right? Yeah, you don't. But you can heal. Buff Fulnery. You, you might have to heal too, honestly. This is not my cup of tea. I like how everyone has like a fair, nice pool of HP. Let's just go back a little bit and heal up. He's just in Lance, whatever. Just be chill about it. And you have the thing, right? No, you don't have you. Who's the one who has the thing? You? Okay, he has it, okay. That's fine. Um, this Myrmidon. I can bait him. It's not much trouble. Oh, he's a red gem. Uh, I would like to bait that and kill, steal from that. She's so gonna end up here. So I can go there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I can go there. Seems good. I can steal here though. And then we'll probably end up baiting one or two more enemies. That's fine. How bad are you against these guys? Very cringe. Let's not do that. So this. Goodbye. Arcady's not afraid of mages. He's a pure water. Uh, this mage me. Yeah, he might hurt a little bit. I don't know how much. He only has a thunder tome. 13. It's gonna do like. Sinner's damage. To him. I think I would die if I like, get hit by both axes and the mage, that's about it. Uh, what I might even do, one little trick, is I like, go here, and I bite bait one of the enemies attacking her, but they can't gang up on her. Cause she's the most fragile unit here, right? Oh, Killing Edge. Gaming. Nice iron, man. It's okay, we got this. Finally, Larissa, I could armor it. I know, right? Okay, clearly the bait didn't work. Uh, is he gonna die to the mage now? Is the mage here? Honestly, this time if he dies, I kind of want to like, leave him. He deserves it if he dies. Okay, nice dodge. Level 17, 13 strength Larissa. Gaming. Yeah, he definitely has blood armor at this point. There's no denying it. Maybe I should check weapons. Mm. Double? No, double? Cringe. I mean, if it's built for Iron Man. Hmm, I think the other lads were deeper into town to fetch some swords. I have my own plans. Didn't have to go for it, but a little intimidation goes a long way. Old Captain Borsch won't be able to make fun of me now. He's always saying stuff like, Oi, you layabout. Get up here and fight. you doofus, that ain't the stern. It's the starboard. Idiot, that was my sandwich, but no more. Behold, the steel axe. Well, it ain't no steel blade, that's for damn sure. It'll do just fine. In fact, let's give it a whirl. Captain Borst will make me first mate after this. Captain Borst. Borst. <laughs> this guy's great. I like him already. Captain Borst is the best. Alright. So we actually have a mage near a bunch of armor knights. That kind of makes me happy. I just wish you could use the Thunder Tome, but I know that pretty cool. Um, Steel Bow. So technically, if I go here, he can't reach me until I kill the armor knight. But this guy will probably murder her if I go there. So let's not do that. In fact, we want to go on the ship. Uh, we can go through the Armor Knight after we kill him. So we go hit here. We go here. One, two, three, four, five. I wonder if Nazar will attack my poor guy. I think I'll go like one outside of his range. That's so I can shove him next turn. Uh, also, I need to shove her so she can steal the red gem. So probably going to use Lyra for that. So I want to go here so I can be shoved next turn. I can warp, I guess, to get that done. I don't think I really want to. Right, let's just go here. And then go back and shove. Might even need two shoves. No, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Uh, the problem is I need to shove him out of the way so that we can kill him. Because otherwise I can't attack. So this is a little awkward. Also awkward is my video all tabbed. Let's see who we need to kill here. We need to kill that mage who's in a force, which is cringe. Or everyone but themselves. Yeah, he can lead others to a he guide, can guide others to a tile he cannot occupy. Uh, this is fishy. Fire tome is fine. 
We're gonna have to rescue someone. Yeah, I want that red gem. That's why I'm uh, holding off on that other part. Goodbye. What's the best of fee game team? Is that like, hey team, what's the best of fee game? Or is it, what is the best team in Fire Emblem games? Hi Fluffy Ninja, how's it going? Thank you for being nice. This is an easy kill, but I think I might need him to fight this uh, axe guy. Actually, what if Marlin with his blood armor attacked here? That's pretty neat. I might just do that. But I think it also results... Oh, nice. <laughs> the best FE game. Well, the least controversial one is Radiant Dawn, definitely. This game, I can see how this headache can do this. So far, it's been easier than expected. I thought it would be way harder. Uh, but I'm glad. actually really happy with the difficulty, because I don't like super difficult games. I like them occasionally, but not blindly. Okay, so if we gang up, we can get them, and then we can have our Pegasi do the other thing. Sandwich? Hey, that's a food counter. Is this still axe food, guys? Uh, we can go in a forest, apparently. It's kind of cool. Uh, you're not baited yet. Let's take the forest. Sure, why not? Become super bulky? Well, my units are pretty bulky too, so it's fine. Alright. I actually really like Larissa so far, for some reason. It's just kind of funny. Okay, so we need to rescue... Rescue doesn't even help here. Can I even break the red gem? I think I need to, like, leave him alive for a turn, which is very cringe. I don't want to. I am playing on normal. Yeah, yeah, I know heart mode is different, but my point is, it's been fun on normal. <laughs> even though it's supposed to be, like, vanilla FE hard, but it's generally easier than some FEs on hard. Like, I'm comparing it to, like, FE12, hard 1 or 2, right? Which I think would be harder, for the most part. Ah, uh, what do I do about this guy? Pay 25 gold to kill him. I know, right? That's basically what it comes down to. I want to stress over Marta too much, right? I just like steatables. I just like steatables. Plus, like, I set this all up so I could do that, and now it's like, I can't do it. Okay, how about this? We leave him here for a turn. No, wait, he's gonna kill my priest if I do that. Alright, fuck it, he's dead. I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill you! I'm gonna kill you. It's fine. Those were not that godly, come on. They're fine. They're fine. Plus, there's no way it's designed to be, like, only easy if you get the level ups here. Here you go. Okay, so I can bait with the peg, but I think I'd rather... Oh, I can do both. I can get the village and, pay the, and bait the thing. I think I need some more help on the ship. Why, hello there, young one. I bet you'd like to find a way to better deal with all this cavalry. Why don't you take this? My son was an Imperial soldier and used it to fight in... Kuching years ago. Maybe this will be of use to you. Poor Slayer. You want to be poor? You said that after I killed the guy with the red gem? How dare you. Okay, so we need to hold off here. Can we bait this archer out, maybe? I think I would like to bait the archer out. He seems annoying. Let's do that. Here you go. No, my village! Cringe. That's so fast, what the hell? I didn't even realize they were going for that thing. Well, I guess we don't get that village. Adios, muchachos. Yeah, rip! I don't know if that was important or not. But we'll never know now. Okay, so... Oh, right, my dude's too far away. Uh, this is cringe. I can't get him this turn. And an s rank weapon, probably? I don't know. We'll never know what was in this village. Is it reset time? I mean, what was it? A recruitable character? Hmm... The Fire Emblem? You had a whole Fire Emblem? Get the Nagat home? <laughs> the Fire Emblem, LOL. Not anything important. I think it was a red gem. Well, I already lost the red gem. You guys maybe want to reset, but I don't want to replay this chapter. Probably a shitty item. Honestly, the items so far are pretty pretty good. More Slayer is nice. Sonic, Alondite, damn. How is there so many items in this one chapter? That's kind of insane. I shouldn't have moved her here. I should have moved her closer to here. Because now I can't kill this pirate. Now I can get past here. This makes me want to reset. No red gems allowed. Dude, I don't like losing items. It's a bad feel. 
Well, we continue onwards. The dancer villain. I hate you all so much. Uh, honestly, the thief doesn't die to this guy, so I'm gonna bait him with the thief. It's the vision side quest. A blue gem, steel blade. I hate you all equally. Oh, we gotta use the ruby blade too. Sag faces. A burn heal. Do you kill with ruby sword? You don't kill him with ruby sword, do you? 16 attack. No, you don't kill. Okay, good. Get wrecked. Yes, FOMO emblem. Ex ex exactly. That's the problem. Okay, I'm gonna bait. I'm gonna do something revolutionary. I'm gonna bait many enemies at the time. I'm not afraid. Y'all can come for me. I don't care. I am boosted by pure water and anime. In fact, I'm gonna reuse my pure water here. Because, you know, people die. Remember, S3 rec rec recruitable? Oh, yeah, she probably will. Probably will. We can take care of this guy on our own, right? Uh, basically. If we shove twice, we can longbow, but where's the patience for that, right? Let's just chill. I don't. I want to move up, but I kind of want to move here instead. The talk convos. All these talk convos got me feeling something. So I'm gonna go here and start healing myself. Hmm. How do I advertise best for my dating website? I know. I'll just spam a random cheater and yeah. I'll just spam a random fireman streamer in chat. That'll do the trick. Uh, what you got? Okay. There you go. Um, you're f good. You need to talk. Let's go one less than full. And then talk. Storch. Oh, hey, Fatcher Steel. What's going on? I should be asking you. I'm surprised you allowed Larissa to join us. But well, you know what's gone on between us. How do you feel about it? I'm asking you. I'm not the one who has romantically evolved. Have you ever been? That isn't the point. Don't avoid the question. It's fine, really. Whatever happened between her and I, well, it's been a long time. We were just kids. I may never be totally comfortable with her, but if she's willing to help out, then she's welcome. Hmm, alright. I'm surprised. Huh? How come? For 70 years you've not wanted to talk to her at all. You get skittish like a deer when she's around. It's understandable, given what happened back then. Well, it's fine. I'll deal with it. <sighs> this is still a sore subject. It's a shame, really. He needs to learn to let go. Cringe, bro. Uh, shove, why not? Uh, now that I've done all this, I can go here and uh, wait. Very exciting, I know. Oh no, not that village. No! All my villages. Did I move my peg to the left? To the right? Yeah, I did. Okay, cringe. That village is gone too then. Alright, if, he, if, he, if she crits, I'm resetting. Do not crit. Good boy. Good girl, I should say. I guess good boy for not getting crit. You pronounce vagus list like, like it's some kind of yeast infection medicine. It's almost like I've, I've watched South Park and I'm doing it on purpose. Or use the warp staff. I can't use the warp staff. I gotta do stuff this turn. If I just give you a skill, that's kind of cool. I want that. Don't make me want things I'm, lo I'm losing. This is your only warning. Almost like I've watched South Park, guys. Arm staff. <laughs> Saturday. Most people here probably need some help with their love life. It's a good place to spend a lot of things like. Arguable. Arguable. How's this guy? I wish like, you could just move up last turn and it would have been fine. I would have gotten it. But no, we don't get it. We lose. Good day, sir. Is it a good mod? Yes, it is. Definitely. Uh, if we talk, we can also use the warp staff and do absolutely nothing with it. Call me out like that. I know, right, Jeff? I know, right? Um, we could kill the recruitable, but I propose that we don't. Instead, I propose that we. I mean, I don't want to attack that guy. Oh, I can do this. I can wind up this guy. Being a real human being and partaking with media outside of Fire Emblem? Shocking. I know, right? People can't believe it. I mean, I do always say I'm just a Fire Emblem guy. I don't know other games besides that and Pokemon. Oh, a chest key, how convenient. I can use that on this chest. Um, speaking of using things on things... 
definitely want to do this just to get it done. I don't think I'm doing anything up here anyway. There's like plenty of people to handle whatever goes up in here, so let's help out. Uh, I think Estefir needs like the damage. Wait, is Rayer down? I didn't realize that. I was like, she's getting weapon triangle double bonuses. Why is she so like doing well? But I'm not in a tournament because I don't play Pokemon. It's, it's very, it's very not complicated. I'm actually not sure if we even can kill this guy because we do 16, and then Lady Blade is three times. Three. I think we do just enough. Cringe. Let's go for it. Steel Axe. Google has a hammer. Uh, I suppose he does. I suppose he might actually have the hammer. But he's also on like no HP. I guess he can heal him afterwards. Uh, so I guess what we can do is... This. I just don't attack. To make it more safe. Now we talk. Onism? Is that you? Good god man, carrying a staff? You look about ready to snap it in half. Nazar, it is nice to see you again. However, I did not ever dream that it would be like this. You look troubled. Why are you standing by? There's an unprotected home that looks like a prime target for looting and pillaging. It's unlike you. Are you well? Oni, my old friend, as soon as Borsh started going after women and children, I just couldn't do it anymore. I wanted to be a good guy. Maybe not become a priest and all that, hub hub, but you know, a stand-up guy. Besides, the crew may have been the same since you loved. Since you left. I love the sea, but life of a pirate, nay, it is not for me. Then fight with us, old friend. You always were one of those holier than thou types, eh, Oni? Now look at how you sound, all prim and proper like. Shall I get you a crown too? Walking with the light. It works for me. I have worked hard to correct my speech as well. I still have much to repent for. Plenty of time to repent. Alright, I'm coming with you. Nazar, thank you. Thank you. Bors? That fiend, I know, right? Bors is the worst. He's just so mad that I didn't recruit him in FE6, and now here we are. This is a wrath that makes me sad. I'm gonna go do from here, I think. I don't know how much it takes from these pirates, but he gets weighed down by two, so down to six. 16 attack each. Yeah, he dies to two, so I can't put him there. He's gonna have to go here. But the good news is he only needs to hit one of these 68, so that'll be very easy. He also dies if he doesn't hit one of these 68s. Okay, so that's taken care of ish. Now, I really don't think there's a way to save the village anymore. Unless I'm missing something. Like, I know he has swap. Like, Kanto 1 forward, maybe. But he's not making it to his pirate. Never. Ever. Never. Uh, he needs a heal. The question is, where do we give it to him? We could longbow. But I think the accuracy is worse, so I think I'd rather just be here. Iron Bow, take the kill. Go with Vagisil. I like this guy, he's my muse. And now we can heal, maybe bait some more enemies. Do you have a sword too? No, he has a lance. Let's stay away from that guy then. Instead, we shall support. Oi, Vagisil, you ape of a man. That last arrow almost hit me. I'd be skewered like a kebab. You got too close. Pay better attention. What? I'm up here doing all the real fighting. And you mosey around behind with your bow. You should be paying mind to me, cousin. Your good old pal, Arkady. You both know that if I did that, you'd be dead, cousin. Oof. Your words are about as sharp as your arrows, I see. That was always something that we were good with. A quip for a quick laugh, a snarky comment for a chuckle. Glad to hear you enjoy him, cousin. I'll be sure to make more at your expense going forward. Now if you excuse me, I have to do all the fighting while you stand here. Hey, that's not... There's a sandwich here that they didn't count. I'll take your word for it. Up to 17 we go. There you go. Alright. Um, well, the pirates, gotta, we gotta stop him at some point, right? So, we might as well send Martin over there. Let's... I wanna move the others closer to that. So, here we go. Let's go through the choke point with everyone else. Should have healed with uh, the Lord. Waiting for the kebab. Where's the kebab? They didn't talk about kebab. What are you talking about? Skewered like a food counter. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Skewered like a kebab. You're right. Alright. Food. 18 it is. 
No, my second village. Not the Terrifying Village. I'm starting to miss stuff. Here you go. Wait. Guidance chapters? Don't make me paranoid. I mean, missing guidance is like whatever at this point. I'll take my losses. He's getting skewered like a kebab, I wonder why. It's kebab? Dude, these level ups are cringe. 17x, okay, we're good, we're good. Yo, pure water OP. Mm. Oh yeah, you just need to keep people alive for the guidance too, so it's pretty easy. I remember that part. I got this, guys, I got this. We sit for level ups alone, yeah. <laughs> I agree. Can these pirates stop? And these pirates are in quite a bind. If they fall here, our plans are doomed for the failure. We must engage the enemy and guide our earlier guides. Let's just hope the exit from below the deck is open. Oh no. Oh no. Not the shaman. Not just the men, but the shaman and the children too. Well, shaman are cringe. Uh, one round? Did I deposit my lockpick earlier? I did. Uh, I do have the chesky though, fortunately. So do you want to shaman? Or just shot children? The Pegasus C and... Uh, my man. Oh, I got four items. That's dumb. Can you kill the other one? Because then we're good. You can kill the other one. Okay, let's just kill them both. Overwatch command. Archers. Overwatch is hard. Shams are here to help. Yeah, they're here to help me lose my HP. These nerds are way too going to try to hide still. I need to trade away my thing, but not right now. Uh, maybe this is the play. No, it's not. Uh, chest key. Kanasa is the only one. Kanasa is really the best ever. No exceptions. What if we go... I want to do that trade before I forget it, but I'm probably going to forget anyway. I also want to attack somewhere where I can heal, but I guess this is going to have to be it. They can free shot when something moves in range is ridiculous. Yo, are we talking about Mario and Rabbit Kingdom now? Yes, it was comedy. It was comedy all along. Got him. I can't believe there's a chapter called 2 to 3x. Here you are. Okay, what's going on here? Uh, looks like you guys are in dire need of an armor knight that can actually take hits. In fact, I'm just about done with that guy, that other guy. Uh, you have five move, right? So you might as well make use of it. I played Mario and Rabbids this afternoon, but that game is honestly really hard to play well. Especially if you're used to Fire Emblem, you like, you just start Analyzing it from a final perspective, and everything just feels wrong. Everything you do feels weird. A train wreck over here? Nah, just uh, just a car crash, not an actual train wreck. Hello, Kirby, nerd, nerdy car. Uh, I wonder if you will attack me now. Probably will. Let's uh, let's ask him the question. There you go. And you could kill this pirate. It's a little dangerous out here. His calves. Because if you get hit, it won't be fun. So let's chill and vom. Yeah, it's an XCOM like game. But Fire Emblem Logic just doesn't work for it. It's very annoying. But in a game Mario, whenever an enemy like moves near him, he can just shoot them. Or at least he has a skill that makes him do that. It's uh, kind of OP. Alright, we're gonna still mess pathetic. Look, I just want her to not miss. I missed an 84 year today. A dating website. It was not fun. It was no bueno. Okay, finally we can get this chest with my mage, my chest getter, traditional one. Moonraiser. Effective versus dark magic users. Yo, that'd be very helpful if we had it. Five use chest key. How nice. There's no other chest in this chapter, right? It's not. 
Alright, so who wants to fly up there with me? Who wants to take a take a flight? I'm gonna heal you. Such moon calves, yeah, I love moon calves. They're my favorite. That healing music though. Dun -dun. Okay, so what are we gonna do here first? Let's figure that out. Uh, we're probably gonna stay around here with the archer. I gotta say I like the archer, although I kinda wish this was a KO. I kind of assumed it would be. I guess it's my fault for assuming. Uh, in that case, it's Larissa time. I gotta say, I kind of prefer the old school knight animations over these uh, newfangled ones. I get that new and like custom is cool, but come on. The old armor knights are sick. What's wrong with the GBA ones? Why do you, why do you need to reinvent the wheel, you know? Uh, I'm gonna put storage here. If they dare to attack him, they're gonna get skewered, like a kebab. Okay, I will vaulm him. We'll vaulm this douche. Just so he doesn't accidentally die. Is that far right village? Uh, might as well. Oh! Alright, wonder what they're gonna say. Now I need to check this. Hey, you're fighting pirates? Wow, that's so neat! I thought pirates were cool, because they're always saying stuff like Ah, mate, or yo ho ho, and they have sweet beards. Heck, I hope I can get a full, cool facial hair too someday. Man, I wish I could be out there with you, but my mom would be really upset if I left here, so just take this. Also, I'm dead because the pirates stepped on top of my village. I think it works kind of like a candle. Good luck! Easy. See you guys, I saved the village. Easy. I could probably visit it again too for another torch. Alright. The real village was safe all along. Works for me. We take those. The game has mercy. The, vis the village played on casual mode just because they, they knew I couldn't save it. Uh, I want to check out the vendor. I'm going to do that right now. I think there's nothing I want to get in right now though. Like men's are nice, but I don't want to spend my last cash on it. So I might just like... Now nah, I'm going to attack so I can do something else next turn. On the village, you can get almost infinite Jigushes later. Damn. <laughs> yeah, now finally something to do for Natsuko. Nice job, Marlin. You got hit by another pirate. Low on energy for sure. We did it, Sark. We saved the city. <laughs> Alright, Larissa is good. Now you know. Was so good. Term will abuse. Not term will abuse. I'm just really good at this game. Oh, you are attacking my cat's bulger. And staff rank. I don't know if you can visit again, actually, but surprise this works. I mean, now you can't visit anymore. Maybe she left her on top of it. It's kind of strange. Does this work? Wow. Insane. I kind of don't want to because Arch is going to hit me for free for like a bunch of like turns. Because I take 16. I take 8. So I'd rather be able to like hit him first. You know what I mean? Before he gets there. We'll do it next turn. Honestly, that looks so small to me. It's not that bad. It's fine. Um. Well, these guys are like already dead. Bye. Plus, there was an Amstaff in the village. They managed to resurrect their kit with it. You were right. I have a staff of ages. Uh, it's taking some time. You could say it takes ages, but I think the joke has been made. Um, let's try out Wrath Dot Pirate on this uh, on this dude. It probably is just his chapter where he'd be well, more well known. Okay, Mr. Pirate, take me on. Actually, I'll bait the archer or whatever. I don't care. You have a javelin, right? Let's go here. This is still fine, right? No, we need to go up. In fact, we can attack this pirate. Hey, we can bait the other archer too. This will be quite the gaming. That was just port, a port town committing insurance fraud. I mean, they gotta do something about these taxes, man. These taxes are killing. They're so high. That's why they're fighting because of taxes. Uh, you don't have a hand next to you. And that's bad news for you because I'm just gonna go here and use a phone. 
Did you get rid of your thing yet? No? How about we do this then? Here you go. I mean, I think we completed the vision quest because we got a torch staff, personally, but that's just me. You know, no one will, will agree with that one. She's wine and taxis. Oh shit! I thought she was at the crit there, but no, she was just hitting him. These fighters got nothing on me. These bow fighters. That's what they're called, right? Bow fighters. Not hunters, not archers, just bow fighters. Dude, everyone attacking the Rosa, she's surviving. The Rosa does not belong in this hack, she's too OP. Alright, can we reach with Calf Guy? No, we cannot. We, we stayed out of range. Well, we can get the village at least. Our pals and I like to have some ale and throw hand axes at targets. It's something we do for sport, have competitions and all that. Do we count ill again? Let's count ill again. 19. But if these pirates destroy our throwing range, we'll be ruined. That fine lass at the inn. She's always giving me the eye when I wind up my wind up my swing. If I can't compete, I'll never win her heart. Please take my trusty axe and rid of those pirates. Not for all the town folk, but for my one for my one shot at love. Hand axe. You know what? I kind of had a feeling it was going there when he started talking. Uh, I see a pirate. Uh, I see a pirate that doesn't want to die in one round. That will do though. Uh, Wrath man cannot reach unless I could use the shove command. Will that do? Probably. No. Um, well, now we kind of fucked ourselves, didn't we? I think we can still get it though. Might have to use this Burgundy guy over here for this. Oh yeah, glad I got to see this crit. <laughs> That's good. That's good. Yeah, very relatable villager. I hate it when they shoot my destroy my aiming range when I'm shooting. I don't even know where this is going. Um, I'm gonna get a kill with the um, Fagisil, so I guess we're doing this. Uh, you can kill the archer, right? Just don't miss. Easy. The animations are good, I agree. Here you go! Our level ups have been kinda cringe, but our bases are so good right now that it doesn't matter. High bulk is so high in demand. Uh, you don't move, do you? No. I think we got everything else. Which one would you recommend for me the most out of the all of you ROM hacks? When I enjoyed three houses and the one with Hector Edward and Company. Um, most of them will be most like Edward and Company. So that's good news. So far, I'd recommend this one. The Last Promise is great if you enjoyed FE7, uh, which is the one that Elwood is at Elwood because it's uh, based off of the same game, similar structure. Uh, last one is a bit outdated though, in a lot of ways, but like it's a classic for me, so I enjoy it. Yeah, that was a bit cringe this chapter. Holy shit! Shove the boss off the tavern and visit it. I doubt that because like there's no tile to shove him to. There's no tile that he can move into. You cannot shove people. That I have no place to go, you know? It's kind of philosophical. Um, I would recommend the Requiem Hack. Hack? Requiem? Like, Fire Emblem Requiem. That one's like, it's pretty vanilla, but that's probably might, that might be why you enjoy it, you know? Uh, we can talk to Larissa, apparently. Let's do that next turn. It is one of skills, which. I mean, if you like three houses, you might like skills. Last Promise does not have skills, and neither does, uh... What's it called? Uh, oh, we shot her. We could have gotten here one turn earlier. I know this is one has, like, hurry up reinforcements, but here we go. Giant Ball, Death, move out! Oh, actually, we can we can attack with her. Don't want to, but I can attack with her. Any skills? Just Night Hill, right? Okay, so we actually don't get the plus three speed, then? That is unfortunate, because that would let us double. Still do massive damage with this, but you know, let's milk him. Milk him! Yes, turtle emblem, exactly. Yo ho ho! What is it here? A bit of fighting ya? Har! I always love me a good tussle. Let's begin! Bit of Kirby music, I just can't. 
This isn't a good ROM hack. I mean, there's a lot out there these days. I'm not the best person to ask, honestly. Okay, let's give him a longbow hit. Just because we can. It doesn't occupy a space that someone else can occupy. Uh, there's a dialogue here I wanted to do. Talk. Lyra, stand behind me. It's important that you don't expose yourself. Without any armor on, you're likely to get hurt. Yeah, but if I wore armor, I'd be slow as all heck. Clanking and clunking around, barely able to move. I may as well serve myself on a dinner platter for him. Or dinner plate for him. Yo, dinner plate? Dinner is food. I mean, it's kind of cannibalism, but you know. They do it, Larissa. My father has many relationships with suppliers. My armor is made from the finest materials that money can buy. My father custom fit this armor so that I can maintain full motion, allowing me to... There, are you even listening? Huh? Yeah, your dad is great, yeah? Must be nice to know who your father is, huh? Well, you and your mother are quite close, no? Yeah, but she likes to nag me over every little thing. That seems pretty neat. That seems pretty neat. Well, yes, I love my father. <laughs> but Lara, your mother loves you very much. My mother died of an illness when I was small. At least you have a model of womanhood to look up to. I didn't have that. Oh, I'm sorry, Larissa. I didn't mean to be insensitive and all that. I just, I just want to be independent, you know? Sometimes Lara, independence is thrust upon you. Even when you are not ready. So while your mom is around and still wants to mother you, enjoy that time. Treasure it. Yeah, I will. Thanks, Larissa. But if you're ever looking for a mom, you can borrow mine. Your mom is a fine woman. I can only wish to have as many talents as she does. Thank you, Lyra. No, Swedish. Swedish? Swedish. You do like no damage, right? Not enough. I mean, it is enough, but like... I'm not liking this guy's stats very much. Um, you can go anywhere. We can kill him this turn, then this is all fine and dandy. I think we can kill this turn if we force ourselves to. We can give him a little LTC. We can always give him this, too. Let's give him some of this. That's what it's made for. Hmm. Four skills, yeah. I mean, two of them are generic Steve skills, but still, you know? It's there. Uh, do you talk to anyone else? No? Okay. Uh... Who do you feed this to? I don't think she's gonna hit first. Actually... Actually, I like the hit rates in general are just pretty high here, which is really enjoyable. I might just give another kill to my lord, though, because, you know, it's my lord. My lord. To face death, I, the sooner that I like, just throw me in the sea. The sea man is he. Goodbye, boss. Is everyone alright? Yes, we're all accounted for. Ooh, that was intense. I thought the bandit thing was tough. But fighting them is a whole new level. But it's not over yet. Look there. What? Imperial soldiers? So these must be the brigands. We've done quite a number here. You're mistaken. They've saved us. Lies. I recognize them. They were stealing from a nearby village months ago. They were a threat to your safety. Men, pursue the bandits. Ha, fools. Hmm, what was that? You hurt me. Grand and his men are thugs, terrorizing the cruel people with this cruel food. The excess collections are nothing but theft. You will seize this talk, or you will be tried for treason. Thought so. You commoners like to talk a big game, but when push comes to shove, you run and hide, letting the soldiers do all the fighting. Get one whiff of a tussle and you turn till and run. No matter. After them. Ah, yes. Such cowardice to not die. They're heading this way. We need to escape. Now. There's an old road where it's said smugglers hit their prizes. That may be our best bet out of Port Irene. Sounds like... Sounds shady, but that's our best bet. Yeah, she's a huge L. Let's move. Alright, there we go. Whew! We need to see, man, when you have Onis and the Warp Man. The Warp Man. Yeah, he's great. I like the characters in his hack so far. Uh... I'm not going to play another chapter, but I'll talk briefly about my thoughts so far. I'm enjoying my time with the game. I hope it's obvious. Uh, I'm The food counter is a joke, but I do enjoy the writing overall. It's clearly a little bit tongue-in-cheek with all the food, but other than that, it's quite serious and quite charming. I like that they got a little interaction with each other through all, all these talk conversations. It's a little hard to get them sometimes, but I manage. The difficulty is good. Um, it's, it, I know it's probably going to get hard at some point. Right now, I'm just enjoying the difficulty level to that. It's not hard enough that I can't look at chat and like make fun of the game and little like do little meme -y things. 
Uh, but it's also not easy enough that I can't just turn my brain off. Like people do actually die. Tongue in cheek, that's a food. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> it's uh it's fun. I, I like where this is going. Um I can't say I'm keeping track of all the relationships and countries just yet, but it looks like the game at least repeats itself quite a bit in the story, which is good. It's something I noticed in Tearing Saga as well. That game is like really elaborate lore, but at least they have to like courtesy to repeat things every now and then so that it doesn't get it. You don't just miss things super outright. I'll definitely have forgotten a lot of things, but next time we play this, so hopefully uh, I won't ask too many stupid questions and chat will be too offended with me asking them, but they're fun. Favorite unit so far? Um, They're all pretty fine. I like the five move Armor Knight Larissa, uh, just because she can tank things. The other people aren't as durable. Uh, the guy with the throwing axe gives me fortune like vibes because it's like he has like a it feels like he has a Puji, but then it's not nearly as strong. And the guy is like she level up so far. I think right. I forgot what his name is. I'm not gonna be good at remembering names. Um, who else is notable? I like I like using the archer. He's pretty big and beefy. He hits pretty hard. Uh, so he's kind of fun. The main lord is fun enough. He's just it's kind of like he's using gonna. Generic Merc, a little stronger maybe, a little more balanced than like Raven is. And like stats are more close together. But I think my favorite has to be the Archer so far. The the Fadger Seal, he's pretty funny. I just keep Goku out of the stream where he's also gonna eat all the stored food we gathered. <laughs> Gotta love that food. Um remember here's where you get further shock. Oh, you get Roy here? Nice. Let's go. Um But yeah, that's uh that's gonna be it for today. I'm gonna stream this every streaming day, so Wednesdays and Saturdays from here on out, so uh, 8 p.m. Central European time, I think that's 2 p.m. Eastern time for you Americans out there. So if you want to see that more often, tune in every now and then. And I hope you enjoyed this as well as my new Let's Play of Tearing Saga, which is going to be uploaded one, one or two times a week. And of course, I'm going to continue playing uh, FE9 as well and upload some other cool videos I'm working on as well. There's a lot of projects in the works. Thanks for watching, everyone. And thanks for tuning in. I will see you around. Peace.